Hey everybody, how's it going? It is time for more Yakuza. It's Friday night, and I'm super excited to get back into this. So how are you all doing tonight? I, I see you got my little gift dragon. That was when we finished up the Battalion Wars Challenge Run, and I just felt generous, so I decided to randomly give the sub out to someone in the community, and, well, you're the lucky recipient. Okay, so we got some things we need to do in town. Uh, we, we still got the stuff over here in Sunshine that we need to take care of, but I think we're going to give the girls a bit of a break because their HP has been going down a bit. Work was busy as hell, but got the uh, Bowser Castle Lego set ordered. Nice! So, what I think we're going to do, I'm going to look around town. If there's any side quest we can do, I'm going to do it. And Roll if out the welcome wagon, boys. And if Dragon wants to give me a host, he can do that as well. Thank you so much for that. Uh, if there's any uh, side quest to do out here, which there is one up there. And that's about it. So, we'll probably... Oh, wait, there's one over here in the, the bar as well. So we run into libido. Uh, Tamo will just appear out of the... Oh, God damn it! It's... Speak her name and she will show up. Hi, Tamo. <laughs> and on cue! <laughs> uh, this is one of the re reasons why I've loved streaming Yakuza. Just the insanity and, and the fun that we've all been having from said ex insanity. Ooh, what? Oh, hi. Sleep it off. But yeah, anyways, uh, just the reaction to said insanity this game has brought us and all the joy this game has brought us is, you know, one of the best things about it. Oh no, it's him. How much money does he have on him? You know what? I'm going for it! What? You again? Why do you keep coming after me? None of your business! Shut up and let me punch you! Or hand over your money! So if I let you punch me, I can keep my money? Yeah. No, I'm taking your money either way! The hell kind of choice is that? Sometimes sacrifices need to be made for the greater cause. And you're, and you're the one on the table. Alright, well, guess what? I got a shotgun. Oops, wrong button. Now, how do I work this thing? Oh, right, that. Ow. Uh, ah! Okay, shotgun, not the best for this guy! Okay, uh, we can talk about this, right? Surely we can. Oh, dear. Alright, don't worry, I got the bonk! Damn it, timing was off with it. Get out of here. Ooh. Ooh, uh, that, that was too risky. Oh no, 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 no! It's a good thing I got a lot of medicine on me. Ow. I need more medicine. Oh, no. Oh, no. I know what's going to happen. Okay, maybe not. All right, come on. Wait for the bonk. Wait for the bonk. Got him. Oh, what was that move? Oh, no. Oh, that's a taunt move. Nope. 
baseball bat taunt is actually pretty good. Ow. Okay. Okay. I need health. <laughs> Look at me wiggle my bat. Look at me wiggle my bat. Uh-oh. Uh, do I have any weapons that are usable? I got a shotgun. I have a shotgun. I have no idea how to use it. Oh, God. Get out of here. Ooh, look at that payout. I win. Look, you can forget about trying to beat me. So just leave me alone for now on or leave me alone from now on. Deal. This is all going wrong. My plan isn't working. Plan? What's this plan of yours? Has it got anything to do with you coming after my money? The shakedowns are a necess necessary part of the plan. I will not stop until I achieve my primary objective. You're barking up the wrong tree. You ain't getting a single yen from me. You say that now, but I'm gonna keep training. Next time we meet, I'm gonna clean your wallet. Oh no, not the sip tamo. Alright, well, I feel good about myself. I probably should pay a visit to the weapon shop to get these guns fixed. Uh, I'll save that one for later. I do want to see what's going on over here, though. Hmm? Uh, these guys? No. Oh, there it is. Hmm? I'm all about whatever that smell is. I want in on that. I mean, I do have the money for it now. place is pretty popular, ain't it? Huh. Must mean it's good stuff. What the hell? Hey, hey excuse me! Whoa! Did she just seriously cut the line? That ain't right. What is this outfit she's wearing, by the way? Hey, lady, no cuts. Get in line like a normal person. Ah, uh, you weren't even in line! Come on, lady. You get your eyes checked lately? I was standing in line right here. I got one more eye than you, Sonny. If anyone ain't anything straight at you. Okay, you just earned yourself a bonk. <clears throat> what a stubborn old hag. Hey, come on. Can't you take this elsewhere? I'm trying to run a business here. See? You went and got us scolded. How embarrassing. If you weren't trying to cut, this never would have happened. Oh, so scary. This whole bat's a real pain. What's my... Oh, no, I just realized something. When I when I feel... When I finish this mission, I get a feeling she's going to be trying to join the cabaret. Uh... Move her aside. She ain't going to see reason. Better just relocate her. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Well, you cut in line and then you refuse to move. Pervert! This pervert's trying to grope me! G grope ya? I wouldn't touch it with a cattle prod. Help me! It's a pervert! Hold on now. Stop making a drama. Uh, stop making a damn scene. Mama, what's a pervert? Don't point, hero. You don't want. You don't want anything to do with that horrible man. Hey, that ain't true. Hero, your mom's got the wrong idea. Ugh. Ugh. Treacherous old dingbat. Wait, what the? Uh, hey! Where do you think you're going? Man, I'd drop it if I were you. She's a pretty infamous, uh, 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 abitarian? Alright, whatever. In these parts. Avatarian? The hell's that? 
You ever heard of an old lady called an Obasan? Well, she's like that. Multiplied by a tank battalion, hence... Oh, a battalion. Oh, a battalion. A battle axe has never been as sharp as... Or as deadly as her. A battle axe? She's just an old lady with a terrible taste. When you get right down to it. Says you, trust me, you don't want to get involved. Underestimate the Osaka Abatarian at your own peril. The Abatarian, huh? You'll get yours next time, old lady. Hmm. <laughs> Something tells me it's going to be at the arcade. First things first, I'm going to go get my guns fixed. Nope, not not the arcade. Here we are. The Karen Kraken has awoken. Oh, we got results. I forgot I sent someone out last time. Things got awkward. Negotiations part uh partner's mom stepped in. But we got a, a, a success. Got a Tomfa double uh, double slats. Don't know what that is. Oh, that must be like the twin sticks. Quality iron chains, iron screws, Indian cotton cloth. All right, cool. All right, uh, let's repair. I'm shuddering to see how much that golden rifle uh, costs for repairs. All right, no, uh, I almost had a mild stroke there seeing the two million. <coughs> <coughs> 25 million! <sighs> Give me the Tomfa back. Give me my sardines. Give me my crowbar. Holy hell, 27 million. Generally believed to be... Uh, uh, Pomatsu of Oba, Japanese for middle-aged woman, and a uh, battalion from battalion. The Japanese title for the film Return to Living Dead. Japanese Abatarian believe in a manner not unlike flesh-eating zombies. The Abatarian is selfish and unwilling to abide by or is oblivious to the socially acceptable behavior. Typical Abatarian for short, stout, wears a, uh, wears a perm, and is dressed unfashionably. House slippers optional. She will elbow her way through the crowds. Uh, oh, ref refuses, and that's where it cuts off. So yeah, basically, Karen. Alright, what do we got? Uh, let's see. Knuckles, decorative spray, shotgun. Iron pipe hole, protective, golf club. Nah. Blackjack spray handgun. Nothing there. Dual poles, poles, nah. Knife knuckles, nah. Chinese broadsword, nah. Umbrella, dagger, shotgun, nunchaku, iron pipe, sword, handgun, police baton, nah. Uh, refuses to wait in line, run for empty bus train seats, is loud, and loves sales. Alright, uh, what do we have to sell? Alright, uh, I'll keep the antique gun and the frozen sardines. Mm, I'll sell the dagger just because we have the super spicy knife and don't really need it. The lighter is completely useless to me, so I'm going to just sell that. The Tomfa, the gloves, I don't see anything. These are all, like, items. Yeah, I'm just going to sell those. Oh my god, Dragon, that all makes sense now. The Karens are pissed off Octopi. Karens are impossible to understand because they are an aspect of Cthulhu. It all makes sense now. <laughs> I'm definitely going to be using that golden rifle sparingly from now on. I'll put the double, st double slats on just to see how well I play with them.
You know, that kid's mother had very ma uh, good matching pants for that Karen that we ran into. Have a good time. Oh, nope. Hmm. I have to be missing something. Hmm. What would I be missing out on? Nah, I don't want to play Space Harrier. Get it? Did we get ah? I guess it would be easier to get it from like the ones on the left side instead of the ones in the back. All right, we got this one for sure. Maybe. Yep, we got it. Mega Drive stuff toy. And sure, I'll grab an Opa Opa as well. Maybe. Oh, oh, ah! Damn it. I don't know what I was supposed to do in here, because the thing did say to go to the Sega Arcade. Unless that I need to walk in, then walk out? No. Hmm. Now it says it's in the arcade, but I don't see where I need to go for it. Maybe I did need to play Space Harrier. Oh no, she's back. There's that wonderful smell again. Come to think of it, I didn't actually get anything to eat last time. Now's my chance. Hey, excuse me! Oh, the Arbitarian strikes again. Well, hello again, Eyepatch fella. You gotta queue up. I'm the end of the line. Get real. I ain't letting you pull the same stunt again. What? You gotta cop another feel? I don't come cheap. Yeah, right. They couldn't pay me enough. I hate, I hate having to repeat myself, but cutting in line is bad form. Get behind me. Hello, Esko son. How's it going? Oh, Michiko san, isn't this place so tasty? Uh, hey, what do you think you're doing? <sighs> God, chat, they're multiplying. <laughs> Make an exception, <laughs> use the golden shotgun. <laughs> I mean, I got two bar barrels, and there's two of them right here. One barrel for each. <sighs> do, do I shove them aside? Reason this time, they're coming out of the woodworks. I feel like there's no way uh, to get out of this peacefully, but sure, why not? If I lay a hand on her, she'll start shouting the p word again. Look, it's clear as day this time. You cut the line. Now get behind me and wait your turn like a normal person. So unreasonable! I haven't seen my friend here in ages. Maybe you ought to get that stick up your ass checked out, Sonny. Here, listen here. Why don't you quit being so damn selfish? Oh, scary! 
Oh, you know, it's a good thing we took the diplomatic option this time. What seems to be the problem here, ladies? You gotta help us, officer! This scary fella's been a real terror to us poor defenseless old ladies! Yeah! We were just chatting with each other when he started shouting obscenities! What? You two windbags cut the line! Now, now! Why don't you have some candy and calm down a bit? It's as sweet as it comes! What the hell? You think this makes it all better? What am I, five? Eh! Officer, help! Ah, uh, damn it, fine, screw this. He's just a common thug. How do I end up getting painted as the bad guy? Abitarian is one cunning adversary. <laughs> the thing is, it's not as good eye twitch in there, Dragon. It's the one under the eye patch. What is this place? Oh, it's a bar. You know what? Screw this. I'm going to get drunk. Maybe. If I can find the entrance to this place. Here we go. No, that's not it. Here, whatever this place is, I'm eating here. You know, your eyes switching. You know what? I need some comfort food. Okay, let's see. We got crab, we got crab, we got even more crab, we got... Oh, so much crab. Oh my god, all the crab. More crab, even more crab, and... Oh, yep, more crab, more crab, all the crab. So much crab. And then crab we already eaten. Uh, you know what? We're going... We're, I need... I've not had a good meal in a long time. Where's, where's that king crab? Crab, um, um. Mm, why no? <laughs> we go from dealing with crabs to eating them. <laughs> Are they back? Yep, they're back. Uh, 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 uh. There is no way in hell I am letting her work in the cabaret. Come hell or high water, I'll put the woman that was running that boy ragged last time in the cabaret lineup before I put her in there. Help, pervert! There's a pervert here! You old shitbag! Who are you calling a pervert? <laughs> he fell right into the Abitarian's trap. Oh? You dumb hag. Now you're really gonna get it. Whoa, now we cross the line. This one this one side quest is gonna kill my voice. Nobody gets uh gets cute with the Yakuza bitch. Suck on this. What? What the fuck are you? The eye patch fellow. Hey, I know this old lady's a real pain in the ass, but that doesn't give you the right to pull a blade on a civilian. Huh? Hey, buddy. I know how you feel. I really do. I got accused of being a perv, too. But it ain't worth it. Trust me. Let sleeping dogs lie. You're no match for the Abitarian. Hell, I ain't either. Have you seen her outfit? I mean, look at it. You trying to tell me what to do? You mosey on up and tell me I'm no match for some old hag? You don't know shit, friend. The two of you can share a grave. You know what? I'm angry. I need to take on my frustration, and you'll do nicely. Come on, come over here. Come over here. Come on. And he is out of there. You. You ain't bad. Praise is cheap coming from a chump. Now get lost. Tch. 
You're the bee's knees, Archpatch fella. Bah. I ended up coming to your rescue without even meaning to. I kind of hate myself right now. Well, on closer inspection, you're a fine piece of work. Just like my husband when he was still kind of... No. Why, why are they... Why is that saxophone playing? Please, stop that saxophone. My heart's really pounding. Whoa, 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 whoa dial it down. You're creeping me out. Lady, no need for any feminine wiles. <laughs> oh, the chat is losing it. Oh, but I've got to repay you to set things right. Uh, keep your candy, lady. I don't need a uh, sugar high. Oh, I had something in mind much sweeter than- No! 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 Huh? Come to Gritty, you're fine, handsome de No! Abort! Abort! She she's too strong! I can't hold her off! Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh no, he's finally dead. <laughs> Pop the court too early, sweetie! Nothing to be ashamed of, it's been a while for- <coughs> I think I threw up in my throat a little bit. <laughs> Ooh, get a room, you two. <laughs> oh, please, don't tease. <laughs> the guy at the counter was right. The only thing to be gained from getting involved with an libertarian is misery. <laughs> the toughest creature under the sun ain't a pro fighter, and it ain't the Yakuza. It's the Osaka Nobitarian. <laughs> I feel dirty all over. What a time for me to mention my day. Happy birthday, Tamo. Uh, uh, I feel, I feel, I feel dirty. Uh, it, where's a place to cleanse myself? Let's see, we got a bar. You know what? I need to go to a bar. I need to drink heavily. I need to forget about whatever the hell just happened there. Oh, it's Tuesday. Uh, bartender, give me your strongest stuff. Uh, what's the strongest thing you got? Uh, let's see. 12 year old. Give me that. Happy early birthday, Tamo. It became such a status symbol that whiskey aficionados the world over have heard of it. They use carefully selected, perfectly matured malts to get that great, smooth flavor. Ugh, he needs something strong to... You do not want to know what I just went through, buddy. Ugh, give me this. Give me more. I need more. That's so? I've been doing this for a while, so I can tell by the way you drink. Are you well-versed in various liquors, sir? Heh, <laughs> I wouldn't be embarrassing myself trying to show off to an expert like you. I'd gladly listen to some interesting liquor trivia from you, though. <laughs> I'll be happy to share some of what I know. Just like people, liquors have their own character to each unique. Under understanding the subtle differences may help you appreciate them better. <laughs> well, I'll be looking forward to coming here again and listening to your liquor tales. Gotta go for now. Hi. Very well, sir. I will be waiting. Uh speaking of drink, I need a drink as well. I don't have any water on me. Damn. I'll have to wait until we go to break. Bartender. I, I still need your strongest alcohol. Give me your best shot. Uh give me the VSOP. This is one of Japan's top brandies. This bestseller has won over countless people with its bright, fruity aroma and smooth taste. As for the name, Vsop stands for a very superior old pale. Uh, okay, punch as much one as good I. <laughs>
More. I need some good old-fashioned whiskey. It's another extremely popular Japanese whiskey. Spirits aged in sherry barrels at the Yamakaze Distillery are blended with carefully selected malts and grains. This yields a bright aroma and sweet fullness in the mouth. The and the finish is deep and mellow. A lot of people call it Dharm, uh, uh, Dharma because of the bottle's round shape that looks like a Dharma doll. Oh, that's the good stuff. No. Okay, we're drunk off our ass. I think we've drunken our, our sadness away. All right. I don't think there's any more sub-stories for this time, so let's just head over to the Grand. And then probably do, like, a, a story mission, and then we'll head back to the Cabaret and get to work on that stuff as well. Just one last look through town, and I'm not seeing anything. All right, let's go. Think some scene is also in order. I like the way you think, Dragon, but not yet. お店の中にうちの組長がお邪魔してるんです。組長。ええ。先ほど組長からお電話差し上げたけど。牧村誠の死体を受け取りになられましたよね。どうぞ。親父が待ってますから。当店は見たらな行為は禁止です。お客様。支配人。おお。あんたが真面目くんかいな。硬いこと言うなよ。馬がしらけてしもたやんか。ですが、それが当店のルールです。はいはい。そりゃエロすいませんでした。支配人怖いな。当たり前や。他の客の迷惑になるような真似されて支配人として見過ごせるわけないやろ。ちゃうねんって。その偉んぼなことせん。これでもちゃんと筋通してますし。実はお店の人に頼む。貸し切りにして
にもいい<笑>バシャナ鬼人会中看板掲げさせてもらってる西谷ってもんや鬼人会こっちの欲しいもんは分かっとるやろ真島君牧村真子とちゃんあんたあの子どこに隠しとんのや前にうちの若いもんが真子とちゃんさらいにハリシンとこ行ったやろせやけどあんたが手に負えん言うてな結局わしが出てこなあかんようになってもうたお前があのポンクラどもの頭っちゅうわけかあんた強いらしいなわしゃ強い男は大好きやでせやけどそんなあんたが女一人殺すんでえらい困っとるがもう見てられへんでかわいそうにな<笑>何言うとるんやまあカリカリせんと聞いてわしらが欲しいのはまことちゃんの命やなねあのことちゃんとお話ししたいだけねせやからまことちゃんわしらに渡してもらえんかな<笑>なあええやろあんたは雇い主に蒼天堀の死体がまことちゃんや言うたらええ相手は佐川やろキャバレーグランドの裏のオーナーさんやあのアホに死体が別人やなんてバレやせんわしは口の固い男やまことちゃんさえこっちの手に入れば誰にも秘密は明かさん墓まで持ってったるわお前らなんであの女狙うんやうんそりゃ言うわわしらも人に雇われて向いとるただまあ真島君もそれ知りたいやろうな。なったら、わしから力づくで聞き出してみるか。あんたもそのつもりできたんやろ何や真島くんどないしてん俺は店の中で客殴られへんなあそうかこの店の支配人としての流儀を<笑>なんやなんやあんたほんまにわし好みの男やなせやけどどないしよ真島くんの流儀も大事やけどわしもはよあんたとやり合わなもう収まりつかんでせやそしたらこないしょちょ待って。全然客やないです。強盗ですわ。はよ助けに来てください。何考えとるんやお前。<笑>これでわしは客やないちごちゃん。札も認める立派な強盗やで。支配に言うたことで、強盗まで直らんちゅう流儀はないやろ。大事な店を守るためやな。はよ遠慮せんとかかってきてや、マジマ君。わしゃもう仕事抜きや。楽しませてもらうで。<笑>そこまで言うんやったら月をたる。俺も仕事抜きや。どないかべ、マジマ君。
You know, if there was one person in this game that I'm going to take so much pleasure in beating the absolute shit out of, it's going to be this guy. And we're not going to use the shotgun. No, I want this to hurt. Oh, God. Ah! Get up, Munchman. Oh, boy. Stomp a mud hole into his face. Crap, my stick's broke. Alright, uh, what can I replace it with? My I need something that can hurt. Nah, you know what the Tomfa? What the hell? Make it hurt. I mean, I wanted to, it to hurt, but damn. You know what? Come on, come on. Swing at me. Swing at me. Ah, damn it. Come on. Not falling for it. Come on, take a swing, take a swing. What even is this fighting style? I guess I can't snap his neck. All right, well, in that case, uh... Hey, you know what? Get the Tomfa back out. Oh, wait, that, my, my Tomfa broke? What? I just need one hit. All right, you know what? Screw this. Give him the bonk. Ah, crap. No, I want to give him the bonk. Please tell me that candy actually gives me heat as well. No, it just gave me a slight health boost. Alright, fine. You know what? Screw this.
警察やそこを動くななんやもう時間切れかいな札の旦那方わしがこの店を押し込んだ強盗ですわエロお騒がせしましたなはあ何やそれ待てやにしたにお前らが女狙う理由は何やどっからの命令や<笑>それは次を追った時のお楽しみやお前はもうわしの獲物やでマジマかたかなんなんやお前とにかくこっち来いああの支配人何があったんですか貸し切りのお客様は貸し切りはしまいよえあんなにお金いただいてるのにもうええからお前は札のお手しとけ他のもんには回転準備させろ今から通常営業やおわかりました準備でき次第店を開けます支配人はそれまでどうされてますせやな店開くまで事務所におるわ何かあったら呼べやはい <sighs> Guess I'll wait in the office till opening. Ah,、oh, damn it, my buzz is going away as well. Ah,、oh, well, gives me a chance to go drinking again. First the Karens, now this. <laughs> this is just not Majima's night, is it? Ah, the <laughs> えっと、お店開けるんですよね。営業電話かけときますね。あ、oh, damn it。そ、佐藤。よう、邪魔してるよ。いつからここに。サツが店に入ったすぐ後だ。にしてもずいぶん騒がしかったな。え？それよりマジマちゃんよ。お前仕事置いたら電話しろっつったろ。仕事？牧村誠だ。やったんだろ。ニュースで見たよ。総天堀に浮かべるなんて。ずいぶん派手じゃないのなんですぐ連絡してこなかったほうれん草はどうしたうっかりしてたんやこれから連絡するとこやったはあうっかりねでも妙なんだよな例の女の死体俺はなんか腑に落ちねえんだよ。お前さ、なんでわざわざ死体の顔を潰したのそのくせ死体には女の働き先の服着せたままだ。死体の身元隠してえのか、隠したくねえのかよくわからねえじゃねえか。妙だよな。人を殺したのは初めてだったんや。自分でもよう覚えとらん。気が動転してたってはあ、まあ、そういうこともあるのかなどうでもええやろ。それよりも、もう仕事は済んだんや。これで、登場会に戻れるっちゅう約束やったで。島野の親父に、なしつけてくれるんやろな。その前にもう一つ聞きて。さっき店で暴れてた男お前あいつと何揉めてたんだあいつは西谷って男でなあれでも俺と同じ近江連合の一さんだ鬼人会ってな近江連合ああ
オーミンの中にもいろいろあるがよ。キジンカイは他の誰ともつるまねえ、ハネカイルだ。どこの縄張りだろうと好き勝手やらかす。ソーテンボリのトラブルメーカーってやつだ。ま、俺は嫌いじゃねえよ。ただ、そのキジンカイが、なんでお前にちょっかい出してきてんだ連中と何があった店の中で暴れただけや。ええー、酒飲み慣れてなかったんでしょうが。そっか。まあ西谷のやりそうなことではあるか。<笑>ならいいんだ。ただこの前からお前の動きが妙でさ。なんか俺に隠してるんじゃねえかと思ってね。何を隠してるっちゅう。<笑>気悪くすんなよそうだよなお前が俺に隠し事なんかできるわけがねえもしそんなことすりゃどうなるか身にしみて分かってるはずだもんなよしそんじゃシマノの兄弟とはなしつけとくからよそれまでしっかりこの店儲けさせてくれやなあThat fake body's only gonna throw Sakawa off the trail for so long. Hell, he may already be wise. I got to talk to Lee in a hurry. He should still be with the girl. So I guess we're not staying till opening? Oh, it's already open. Wow, my staff really does clean up fast, don't they? They do good work, yeah? I mean, after all the money I pay them for it, they better be doing good work. Oh, Shihani san! Mate, Chodo Yokata yo! Omae, Janson no Yamisha ka? Li san, doko ni iru? Watashi, Li san ni isogi no yo haru! Isogi no yo? リサ、痛み止めの薬切れる。取りに来るって言ったのに、全然来ないよ。あんた、リーと会う約束してたっちゅうこと。リサ、何かあったか。私とても心配してる。リサ、どこ？落ち着けや。ちょうどリーと話そ
XXX then Y. Reduce the amount of heat you lose when taking damage. Your weapon durability won't drop when wielding a Tomfa as long as you remain calm. Boost defense when in heat mode. Wielding a bat. Weapon durability won't drop. Uh, what about the... What do we have for this? Turn and kick an enemy shin. It may cut... Uh, in many cases, cause them to drop to the ground. Boost the evasiveness a quick step. Boost health. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go with Slugger. And let's get the extra Bat Nunchaku Swings. And we'll save the money that we have for us. And if we run into Shakedown and able to take him down again, I might donate some of the money that I get to Kiryu whenever we get back to him. This is the standard of the McKellen line, aged entirely in sherry barrels. It's perfect for those looking to enjoy the McKellen without breaking the bank. It may be the standard of the line, but it's guaranteed to deliver the McKellen taste. I urge you to experience its sweet, full flavor and bouquet it for yourself. Cook on tonight? Yeah, we will. I'll wait till after first break, though, so we're going to just get drunk at the bar. Do one thing of the cabaret, and then we'll <laughs> jump to CoComs. Yeah. Don't mind? Hi. Not at all. Oh. It's a good whiskey. Yeah. It's the 18-year-old Yamakaze, aged in sherry casks. Oh. Sherry casks, eh? That sounds pretty tasty. Yes, they're casks that are fill, uh, that are first used for aged sherry. The wood soaks up some of it in the process. Then they're used to age whiskey. It becomes infused with the subtle sherry aroma and takes on a unique tinge. Make it sound so enticing, but even someone who doesn't normally drink whiskey would be tempted. <laughs> Bet accepted, but that means you'll have to bring your friends here to test your theory. <laughs> So the free drink was just a clever way for me uh, to make me bring you more customers, eh? They're quite perceptive. Well, thank you for the Yamakaze and the Sherry Cast trivia. I'll come back sometime to learn some more. Yeah. Welcome back, Moon. My pleasure. I'll be waiting. It kicked me outside, didn't it? Yep. Sir, I'm not done. I want your strongest drink still. Glen Fittage 12 Years is the best selling single malt whiskey in the world. This bottle has set the industry standard for a single malt. You'll find it light and fresh. The bouquet is fruity and the finish clean, making it excep uh, exceptionally easy to drink. It's like flavor makes it popular with anyone with a single malt whiskeys. Or new to malt whiskeys, you know what I mean. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff. Alright. Now we got a bit of a buzz going. Let's head back down. And head back to the club. Just real quick. I w we got 6 CP. I think we can get a new girl for the club as well. So we might stop at the temple first though. Give me a second.
Yep, there's one. There it is. That tornado kick is so broken, I swear. Okay, let's see if we can get someone new to work at the business. Nope, we can give it a makeover, though. Ah, we're just one short. Socks of Fortune. Get the Ebitu Socks Accessory. That's Tamosin Bob. Yep, ta yeah, Tamosin Bob. That's 10 CP, though. Jeez. God of War. Get the God of War Talisman Accessory. Enable upgrades in a certain battle style beyond its limits. Bottom of stomach, enjoy foods even when it, it uh, th okay, so that's how I was supposed to eat food that, that, like, uh, just eating them all. Disposable income, throw more money, can't stop me, dash without ever getting tired. Alright, well, we get, we decked out the club a bit, so might as well go check it out. Oh, no, 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 no! Do not engage! <laughs> Sweep the leg, Majima! Ruby plate. Ooh, that's a uh, pretty good quality. Uh, uh, no, no, don't engage. Nope. If I don't make eye contact, then she won't try to talk to me. Ah, oh, damn it! Ow, oh, you're the fellow with the eye patch. It's been a while. Oh crap! That's the Obitarian. What do you mean, all oh crap? Is that what you say when you have a reunion with a beautiful maiden? Try again. Give me the line like, Oh, but my, be still my beating heart. Oh, be still my beating heart. It's you. That's better. Now, what's this I hear about you running the cabaret club? That true? It is, but where'd you hear that? Don't mock the housewives rum rumor mill network. If I set my mind to it, I could find the number of moles you got on your body. Ugh. No, no. Ah, oh, come on. Why do you have to be so graphic? <laughs> so listen, can I come work at your cabaret club? Absolutely not. Uh, do you even know what a cabaret club is? What the heck is an old lady gonna do at a cabaret club? Come on, do me a solid here. The supermarket. I was doing part-time work. Uh, part-time work for went under, and things are tight. Besides, don't underestimate the power of an old lady. I'm an expert at making men feel good about himself. Back in the day, I had any man I wanted under my thumb. Uh, I really didn't need to know that. Look, I just don't think it's going to work. Why don't you go uh, work for another part-time supermarket gig? No! I'm done with that! I'm gonna give you a real nice kiss again if you don't let me come work for you. Huh? N now, just a minute. Let's just calm down here. No need to resort to threats. Choose. Hire me or kiss me. It's your call. Uh, all right, all right. Police! You're hired. You're so hired. I don't care anymore. <laughs> See? Isn't life easier when you just get with the program? Thanks, though. I'm really looking forward to this. WHY IS SHE A GOLD?! It's tell that I'd rather deal with an angry Yakuza than her. Oh, Kansai ladies, don't screw around. You muttering about something? Want some candy? Or do you... Do you want some big boy candy instead? No, 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 nothing. What the hell is a big boy candy anyway? Listen, lady. Just do what you do best there, alright? <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm shuddering all over. What is that? 100,000? Nah. Hold on. Someone seems to be in trouble. Not on my watch. <laughs> we wouldn't hear. I, I, Dragon, I would not use the wood, word wood around here, period. You might give her ideas. That's a knife! He's kind of trying to break his neck, but I guess this will have to work. Moon, why? Gold plate. I'll be sure to sell those before we go over to Makoto and Lee. Walks away hands of defeat, and I thought Lobito was bad. He looks normal compared to her. <laughs> All right, let's prepare. What do we got? Uh, hostess list. All right, uh, let's see. Her condition's good. All right, let's take her off. Take her off. Take her off. <gasps> uh, Dolly, you can go back on. What are her stats? Why is she a triangle and sexy? No, no, just no, no. Oh no, not her, not her either. Uh, Kazumi, no. Kemi's really tired. Harumi's already in. Endo, you can go in. Namako, she's good. Uh, who, who else can we put in? Uh, Kira can go in as well. All right. Oops, nope. Let's open for business. For shits and giggles, put her on the floor just once. Uh, fine. We'll, we'll have a... A night where we put the two worst on there just so they can make some money and then never again. Just for shits and giggles. But not this time. Alright, uh... Dolly, you can go there. Dolly needs a new outfit bad. I don't know, seems like some customers like the... the mom look. I don't really have anyone that's this guy's taste. Uh, Yuki, I guess. Uh, let's see if I remember the hand signs. Uh, I believe that was guest glass. Damn it! I think that might have been ashtray. Oh! Uh, this might not work. But her his mood's actually happiness, although her cute is bad. I'm getting some really bad clients tonight. Let's see. Would you like to extend the session, sir? Yes!
Guess... Ah, no, I think that was her glass. Alright, what do we got? Harumi, you got this guy. Alright, fever time. Ashtray. Yep, that was it. Bring in that money. Let's give her a reward. She she really could use it. They are raking in the money. We'll give him a gracious send off. Oh, so much going on. Uh, Dolly, I guess. Oh god! Nah, damn it! Who said could really use a, re a board? A rude board. Gracious send off. Wow, that was a lot of money he spent. <laughs> Ladies glass, sorry. <laughs> Menu. Oh god, so, so much help. Wow, they really want me to swap out these ashtrays. Kind of hoping to extend the session, but all right. Let's give him a gift. Let's see. Yeah, Dolly can go there. Dolly is becoming the MVP tonight. Would you like to extend, sir? Damn. Come on, can we get to level th two? Ah, oh, damn, I didn't see it in time. Alright, there we go. Got level two. Fever time! Let's give him a gracious send-off. You've been a wonderful customer tonight. And you... So far, so good. Oh, 
shit, hold on. L, L, I think that was guest glass. Yes. I think when she makes it like an M motion with her hand, that was ice. And then when she rains her hands, that's towel. Alright, let's see how we did. Mm, not bad. 12 million. And we poached 455 people. Not bad. I feel like we're not going to get anywhere, though, until we get, like, 2,000. But, you know, still good. Nice. Right, she doesn't have anything to say. Alright, uh, let's go in here real quick. Still nothing with the radio show, so... I guess we'll stop right here to take a break, and when we get back, I'll get Kokums on for tonight, and we shall continue on and po probably just head to Lee and Makoto. And then we'll come back here and do more of this stuff. Alright, I'll see you all in just a little bit.
All right, and we're back. I got the window open for CoCom, so they'll probably hop in a few seconds. And for now, it is time to get back into the game. Hello. Hello. Also, I'm sorry if you hear Rowdy. He's in his uh, crate right now for the night, and he's still not used to it. Yeah, it's fine. I feel violated. Karen's man, Karen. Uh, uh, oh man, a million again. I got to. What did I pull? Wow, that was not worth a million yen. What'd you get? I I, 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 I got the Sega Mega Drive stuffed toy that I got from the <laughs> claw machine. Dare I summon him? As well as her? Mm -mm. I mean, I, I could use, like, a, a burst of heat energy. Uh, I can always put up Contemplating Kiryu. <laughs> Are we gonna are we gonna break our sides again? Yeah, most likely. I just wanna get some heat energy. So we'll go with her. I don't I don't even care. I hear Twitch knocking on the door right now. Don't worry, I got Kiryu <laughs> contemplating what what he's doing with his life. <laughs> Oh god, this is actually the most risque looking one. Why did I have to pick this one? Mm-hmm. <laughs> this one is actually skirting the line of softcore. I mean, they all are, but this one's like really skirting the line at this point. Bringing three times now on offer up, I, I find a PS3 that's backwards compatible. Oh, and I do the buy now option, then a week later they cancel it on me. Why, why did they keep canceling it on you? I don't know. They never say it just randomly canceled. Uh, I did screw it and just now got one off of eBay. Is it is it backwards or is it not? Backwards compatible. I'm, I've been specifically looking for a backwards compatible. Uh, I, I want to <laughs> find a backwards compatible one for me as well, but at the same time, the one I already have has the data for Sly, and I don't want to risk having to redo the game a third time. A PS3? Yeah. Certain PS3s, because for whatever reason, are backwards compatible. The first, the first few models are. Yeah. But then Sony dropped the ball on backwards compatibility for whatever freaking reason. Because backwards compatibility is not profitable in their eye. Oh no, 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 no! <laughs> is it who I think it is? It is. Hey, uh, heard it, did he? Who did he hurt chicks? No. <laughs> <Phew>. No. <laughs> then let's swap in for it's a girl's worth checking oh, out. No. Uh, why are these all sticky? Oh god, dude, what have you been at? <laughs> Would you like to know? <laughs> no, actually, I don't want to know. <laughs> so you go for that tape? Wow, I never would have thought. You got a problem Is with he, that? At least Miss with Libido was funny. Maybe. Oh, nothing. It's just, you know, not even I go for that, but hmm, maybe she's worth a second look. Whatever. Then let's just hear your pick of the crop. Sure. <laughs> yeah, I had to wait there for a minute, just like, line. <laughs> I do, because there's a bit of a delay. <laughs> I know. That about covers it. Is it time for the measuring contest? <laughs> Did someone say measuring contest? <laughs> Please. We, we already went through one nightmare scenario. We don't need to go through two. <laughs> Way too many. Just how horny are you, man? This horny. <laughs> oh, oh my god. How do you even fit it in there? <laughs> <laughs> That's only the tip of the iceberg. 
tip, huh? <laughs> Damn it, you win. <laughs> Just the tip. Yeah. <laughs> I think the tip is all he needs. Shut up. <laughs> but tip. <laughs> oh, something Being else. Being a little shy. I ain't never talked about this kind of thing before with anyone. That was really weird, even though we're both dudes and all. <laughs> what do you mean? The desire to have sex is nothing to be ashamed of. Every guy has it bottled up in there somewhere. Yeah, yeah, I and I, I have a reinforced my baby. Is this where we find out Mr. Libido is bi? Oh no, 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 no! I go always. I bet it felt good telling me about that kind what kind of girls turn you on, right? Oh my fucking god. It does kind of feel like a relief to get it off my chest. I just can't believe you would want to hear me talk about old ladies in leopard shirts and purple hair. <laughs> See? No need to make a big secret out of it. Turn the whole world! <laughs> It begins. <laughs> you know, I need a minute. <laughs> Maybe you got a point. A sucker oh, sure is crazy, have you though. Noticed the, have you What's noticed like, how my underwear gives me so much support that it practically oh, flat down there? It's a contemplating face. You need to do it, TV. Uh, a sucker sure is crazy, though. In this space. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I don't think it's ever going to be. Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait. <laughs> Parallels. <laughs> Parallels. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> TBG, you need to screenshot that. <laughs> Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Why are we still here? Just to be horny. Just to get the tip. <laughs> 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 All, all of a sudden, Bakamite is playing in the background, and they don't know why. Oh, oh God. God. Uh, oh, my side. <laughs> we had to do it at least once this week. Well, that just means we've got to share info more often to raise your batting average. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Please, don't ever call it my bad and average ever again unless it involves me killing people. Do you give me okay? No. Okay, just checking. Well, Libido's currently swinging his bat. <laughs> yeah, but I can't bonk. You know what, Dra Dragon? You know what? Just all the bonks. You all get the bonks. Ow. Ow, fuck. Uh... Ow. Ow. Yeah. Uh... Oh no. Oh no. Huh? That right. My monster's oh, no. roaring. I'm gonna go slay it. <laughs> Have fun fighting the one eyed dragon. Mm. Damn, that guy's <laughs> got <laughs> the stamina of a horse. <laughs> He's a regular Don Quixote. Uh, oh no, the friendship, friendship bar went up. It's the total that's gone up. Z why why do you have so much energy, man? Where do you keep it all? Uh, I think below. you know. I don't wanna know. Really, I don't Let's just say that it's not appropriate for children. <laughs> oh TBG's beating his favorite kind of meat again. It's really hard Sorry. to get the timing for I would bonk you, but at the same time I kinda wanna beat these guys up real quick. Here, have some hot tea. Oh, it was oh. as bad as last time, but fucking hell. So uh, last, last time absolutely broke all four of us. <laughs> Did that guy just pelvic thrust after you're done pouring hot tea water all over him? It, it, uh, that guy just didn't it, it was a post-mortem reaction. And then that other guy, after you stopped on him, like, uh, oh, hard. These guys are weird. <laughs> Why did I hear sounds of bare footprints coming our way? Shut up! <laughs> no, it, no, it wouldn't be bare feet because he still wears shoes, at least. Oh, that's right, he does. He's not a, he's not a weirdo or anything. 
At least he's protecting his feet. H have you had to walk on concrete all 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 day? It hurts. And nothing but your underwear. Yeah, <sighs> just letting it all swing in the breeze. Ouch! <laughs> <laughs> Leave you nothing okay? to the imagination. Oh, my hand. Oh, and people code me weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, so we were busy as hell again today at work, and uh, someone got three fish sandwich combos, a shrimp basket, and then three chicken strip baskets, one of them being honey barbecue. Jeez, that better be a really, like, big order to take home. Not all for just one person. I only oh, heard one for one person. Car. Oh god, is this, is this the same one you've done before? Is it a new one? Yeah, no, it's the same one. Okay. It's the only song Majima sings. Oh. Mm. Really? In this game, at you least. I know any other song? In other games that you play as him, there is. So you can't even pick the other songs? Uh, the other ones, it's like, a, it's a female singer. So uh, he just does the cherry. Yeah, he'll just be there for moral support. I'm addicted I, I, to this I song. Watched... It's actually really good. I, 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 I watched the uh, the first uh, night of this game again. I still can't believe you chroma keyed the Kappa. <sighs> Neither can I. Why can't you believe it's a Kappa? No, he chroma keyed it so it wasn't green, so I thought it was a penguin at first. Oh. And then I pointed out one of the uh, the Yakuza leaders looked like Elvis Presley, like a Japanese version. I don't know, I find it hard to believe that the Japanese even believe in penguins. <coughs> what? 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 <laughs> Want to run that bias again, Tamo? <laughs> Come on. I just wanted to make sure you guys were listening, is all. Come on. I don't know, yeah. Tamo. That Come comment on. seemed pretty black and white. Come on. Bonk yourself. Come here. For what? <laughs> no, not you, Tamo. TVG. Oh, okay. There. Good. Uh oh. I think Moon has a cat. Oh, I get it. Just penguins. <clears throat> penguins are black and white. Say hi. Meow. 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 Put me back down, mortal. Hey. Hi. Uh, so, uh, my dad, he's trying to make Rowdy a, a car dog. And he did, uh, the first day he did it, he whined a lot. But uh, today he was actually really good. He, he didn't whine at all. Uh, he stick no, his head out the go, window. Uh, uh, no, go. No, he, no. he can't do that Thank yet. You, like, he's still, he's only eight weeks old. Ah. Uh. <coughs> All right, let's sell the Mega Drive. Oh. I don't know they're selling Helix fossils. All praise Lord Helix. All praise Lord Helix. I suddenly hear the villager bursting through the doors. You just see him peek around, the, peek him around the corner with the net out, with that evil look in his eye. No, he's got the shovel. Because it's a fossil. Yeah, but the fossil's already been dug. He's going to just grab it and take it in the net. Well, then he just has to pocket it. He doesn't need the net. The net's useful for holding more things. There's two fossils. Now the net's for... Bunking the shopkeeper. I, I need to get back to Animal Crossing. It's been a bit. They have gotten some significant updates in it. I saw that Mario stuff and I want it. Ah, <laughs> 
ジャンバレアの闇者がお前に渡せ言うとったでふんこんなん別にいらんけどなうんそれよりどないやった<笑> I knew it was sus グランドでおたんやろあの何かあったんですか電話の男ってブラディストウワイニングちょっとな There's probably a tracker inside those pills. Or you were tailed. More so, most likely. Probably tailed. Maybe a microphone. Maybe a にしたにも俺の雇い主の佐川いう男も元をたどれば同じ大見連合やどうやら大見の中でも牧村誠を皿う派と殺す派で別々に思いとるらしいせやけど今一番の問題は佐川のことだあいつは多分 俺がミスミスこの子殺さんかったこと感づいたないやとほんまかお前らはすぐ蒼天堀から出た方がええここもさらに見つかるが多分時間の問題やリードかこの子連れて逃げる当てないかまあないこともない。せやけどどこまで
Half-Life is looking Half-Life was looking different. It's time to beat up the homeless. Wait. Oh, they all got weapons. I think. I can't tell what the guy in the green tracksuit has. It's a knife. It's probably a knife. Oops. No, I saw it. It was a knife. And Majima is pissed. Oh, don't worry. I, I You guys may have a crowbar and a bunch of knives, but you know what I have? A baseball bat? No, I got something better. Um, a gun! A gun that shoots baseball bats? Well, I took out two of them, at least. It's gonna be the old plan, that's, uh... Alright, Santa, you gotta go. Oh, oh, no, crowbar. no Santa. For me, you shouldn't have. And they say money isn't a good gift. Come on, get up. Get up. Ooh. That was a really bad helmet if it couldn't take a few crowbar swings. It's then still again, it is hurt. Majima swinging it, and he went for the neck. Yeah, true. せやけど死んだら<笑> お前、誠を連れて早く大手ろ。場所はこいつをジャンバラへに連れて行かな。後で合流する。お前は誠と一緒に小口会館に行け。小口会館。なんで誠を連れながら歩いて逃げ切れんやろ。車がいる。小口会
Metal Gear. Alright, what's our pathway? Alright, not as long as it was the last time we had to play Metal Gear with Makoto. Yeah, come on, turn around. So, is this, is this close to Christmas time right now? In, in the game? I believe this game takes place around Christmas time. I know one of the Yakuza games did. I think this was the one. Come on, come on, come on. Makoto, hide! You think they'd spot Majima from a thousand miles away. You're right, he's not wearing the sunglasses. <laughs> Bob, can you hide us? Damn it, he's out for lunch. He's having a fish sandwich. <laughs> mm, fish sandwich. No, like, it, it, it's not even cooked, it's just, like, an actual fish between two slices of bread. Uh-oh. Do you think Majima would be the kind of person who hums his own sneaking music? <laughs> yeah, in his head, at least. I feel like it would be more the Kronk sneaking music. <laughs> uh, no, actually, that'd be more something Kiryu would be humming. My favorite part of the Kronk sneaking music is when he, like, goes flat against the wall That's... and just holds the note <laughs> as uh, an old person goes by. Alright, hold on. Alright, let's do this. Come on, come on! Actually, you know what? I got a keg. A keg! Bonk! Party on. That that was Maybe. some that was some strong force if it literally shattered upon impact. It didn't shatter it. It no longer exists. <laughs> it disintegrated on impact. Pretty sure that would kill everyone in within several blocks if he hit something with that much force. <laughs> Just a shockwave rips through the streets. Because it would cause a lot of heat, too. Well, it did require me to use a heat move. <laughs> hey. Logan TV talk. Oh, no. <sighs> Why is she moving like she was resisting? Oh, you? shit! Oh. Oh. Jesus Wait, Christ! no! They ain't messing around anymore. Do you think? You just see the libido emerging from the fire. <laughs> Hello, Majima. I like how this is a really serious scene, but we are taking all things the seriousness really, out of it. He, things are really heating up, aren't they? Uh. <laughs> you could say that this grand reveal was explosive. <laughs> ah, damn it, Sagwa was on to us. Please let me punch him in the face just once. Didn't. Truth be told, the game was rigged from the start. Boom. I'm tempted to say something to ruin this guy forever. What? Uh. What? He, uh. 
No, uh, what? What's he, going on? Oh. What? Who's this dude? <laughs> it's Mr. Libido's true form. Oh, he's, <laughs> oh, he's, he's wearing white. When he gets all nice and dressed up, he looks. He he hits different. Man, he grew hair. Got to go OT. Oh, it's the. It's I know who it is. Uh oh. Ow. Well, we got 15 million yen. My other eye. When it all goes wrong. Damn it! Now I'm gonna need two eye patches. It's like Patrick in that one episode. I'm Blind Beard the Pirate. <laughs> oh, hey, we're back Did to you Kiryu. Did you hear they're doing another SpongeBob spinoff with Patrick? Oh, no. Kiryu Kun. You know why they call him Kiryu? Because when you mess with the Kiryu, he kill you. Yep. But Kiryu's <laughs> never killed a person. Shh, they don't need to know that. <laughs> <laughs> Just the legend being there is enough. He's still in that suit. Hey, it's a good suit. It probably smells like garbage because he was running back. through the sewers. Ah, this... Scene. Oh god. I just looked at TV talk. <laughs> <laughs> and then Kiryu left Nishiki abandoned all by himself in the forest, miles away from all civilization. He was later. He was, become the forest he was, he was later devoured by Mr. Libido. God damn it, Tamo, stop stealing my jokes! <laughs> Is devoured so that Mr. Libido could gain, could gain his powers. To be fair, I think we actually do run into Libido here as well. I think we talked to him earlier as Kiryu. Nate, I'm and sure plenty dressed. of words to prepare my voice. <laughs> no, you got no for dressed Libido, you gotta do a completely different voice. Wait, what? Uh, as Kiryu, he tends to be dressed. Oh. Ah. No, I think it'd be funnier to do a, the same voice. <laughs> Poor guy guys ass kick for nothing. Have you tried the karaoke bar? <laughs> Damn it, fell off the arcade game. We're trying to look for Kiryu. <laughs> You know, Kiryu, you might want to put on a different suit, maybe? He probably nah. can't get back on the change. Ah, damn it, my house is on fire. Ah, yep, yeah, there we go. Whose apartment is that? Kiryu's. Yeah, that, oh, that was okay. Kiryu's apartment. Why, Kiryu? Why didn't you stay in the family? Stop wasting time! Have you ever pissed off someone so much that they are literally ready to burn down an entire city just to find you? No, Can't and I, I hope that never happens. To be fair, if someone ever becomes willing to do that, they're kind of psychotic. Well, this is the Yakuza that we're talking about. This is true. Mm -hmm. Damn, Dojima's goons torched my apartment just to tighten the noose around me. I can't risk wandering around out here. I need to find a place to lie low and wait f for a word from Tachibana. Go to Tachibana's place. <coughs> I just hope I can find some place that'll take me in. Off to the pocket circuit place. So Elvis no. wants revenge. Who wants revenge? Elvis. Yes. Thank you very much. Bang. 
<laughs> also, uh, I'm, I'll be right back. I'm going to get some Pepsi. Okay. Oh, there's a... Alright, I know the perfect place to hide. They'll never suspect me being here. What if... What if... There's a game kind of like this, and the big bad was the Elvis impersonator. So this game. <laughs> Never tell me off someone, he just goes, thank you very much. <laughs> uh, New Vegas? No, 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 the king wasn't a bad guy in New Vegas. Uh, de depends on which faction you were fighting for. Well, even then, you can get him to get along with the NCR. True, but you need to not screw yourself out of it at the beginning. True. And you need to not work with a legion, you know, like anyone with anything resembling a conscience. If I stay in here and dance, maybe the Yakuza will finally give up on me. So just take one look at you dance and go, we, we were going to off this guy? But those moves, and they'll though. Ju they'll feel... So <laughs> exactly! I mean, look at these moves! Look at these disco moves! Holy hell! This Bepsi is super watered down, but I'm used to it from work. We need to hide with the disco fever is too much. <laughs> this is certainly a unique way to do a disco thing in the game. Just have a little ghost go over to boxes and press buttons. The little ghost looks, looks like it has a Game Grumps face. It, it's looks grumpy angry. because it's Kiryu, and Majima also has a, a dancing theme where his little ghost guy has an eye patch. That's funny. Pat, the ghost of Patchy the Pirate. <laughs> well, yeah, no, apparently Nickelodeon now has a Patrick spinoff in the works. Really? Yes. Because uh, that works so well with Planet Sheen. And, uh, freaking, he now has a uh, adopted sister who is a, a squid. What? Mm. Yeah. You know, SpongeBob's creator is probably rolling in his grave so much that you could po possibly use the. Did he die? Yeah, SpongeBob's creator passed away, and then they started doing all these spin off things, even though that was something he deliberately did not want happen to the character. Actually, apparently, uh, he was, before he passed away, he was talking to them about it because they presented the idea to him. Oh, uh, the Patrick spin off? Uh, no, I don't know about the Patrick spin-off, but I think he was talking to them about Camp Coral. Uh, because I uh, heard, like, a lot a... of people did not like Camp Coral because of the fact that it kind of went against his wishes. Well, I don't know about the, the Patrick show, but I know Camp Coral was something he was at least talking to them about. Mm. Alright, the perfect, uh... Blend in technique. Dance with a girl because everybody in the Yakuza knows Kiryu is bad with women. Marley, are you drooling all over my bed in your seat? Marley got drool all over my bed. My cat does that all the time when she sleeps in my bed. <laughs> yeah, try when you have a, a big dog sleeping in your bed. Yeah, I'm just looking at things about Camp Coral. Damn it! And there being a young Sandy just destroys any semblance of continuity at once. I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> what? It looks like there's young Sandy in it. Yeah, Sandy's in it. Why? Which it's... completely destroys anything resembling continuity. At this point, modern SpongeBob is where continuity goes to die. 
Uh, remember Patrick said he didn't have his sister, and there was a whole episode about, about his sister, and now they completely erased that sister and gave him a new one? Well, to be fair, this one's a dog. To be fair, no one liked that episode. No, but they're not, they're not even, like, acknowledging the other bigger sister. It's probably best to just not acknowledge it. Damn it, she kicked my ass there. To be there. honest with you. Damn, Kira. I can't believe I you got wrecked. <laughs> no, I must be the dancing king. I think I think the shock of hearing that uh, Sandy's in Camp Coral is uh, was why you lost. Yes, probably. Yeah, no. Everyone from the main cast is gonna be in the spinoff. Well, that makes sense or not. Continuity be damned. Are, are we also but again, being... all the little kids that, like, all the, like, six or seven year olds that under the target demographic probably never saw the episode where they met Sandy for the first time. Yeah, because that was, was like the. Pilot the episode. No, that, no, the pilot episode was the him working at the Krusty Krab. I think it was part of that episode. Like, it did. That was the first part of it, then it went to the Sandy episode. I thought it, I thought it was like, uh,. That was like the second or third episode in the show. Yeah, they found uh, they found the dome there, and they're kind of freaking out about it. And eventually, go in and find it and meet Sandy. No, that happened. no, no. Sandy was uh, Sandy was wrestling with a clam. SpongeBob heard the commotion. Oh yeah. Then, uh, and then he went to go help her, not knowing she was doing just fine. And then they later. Go to her dome. I don't need it. <laughs> I Damn it! Don't need it. Now oh, that fever failed, killed me. <sighs> I. What are you The fever. I don't need it. I don't need it. Are you supposed to do more steps to get the things, or fewer? Yeah. But the timing for uh, the the fever stuff is really strict. No, I'm talking about the button thing. Yeah, like, cover, are you supposed to do a... more steps or? Ah, just barely missed out. Yeah, you're supposed to get like a big combo of steps before you get to the button. Okay, cover as much ground as possible. Yep, yeah, basically. When I continue the SpongeBob movie game, this is just gonna be more quotes of plenty. So, so another thing that kind of threw me off, you were talking about, when you said the the entire main cast was going to be in the, is in the Camp Coral thing, does that mean also Mr. Krabs, Plankton, yep. characters that he did not yep. meet until much later in his, or yep. like, met much later in his life are in it? Mrs. Yes. Puff is there, too. Oh, God. Are they all kids as well? No, Mrs. No, Puff is, like, looks to adults. be, a, like, a camp counselor or something. Uh All right, I'll give this one more shot. And, it, and I think uh, Plankton and Mr. Krabs are like rival lunch aids. Pearl's also there as a baby. Who is? Oh, Pearl. Pearl. Yeah. To be fair to it, what they've shown up so far, like the model's fine, but it's the lighting that looks really weird. Because you know, for some reason, a spinoff based off a two D cartoon is getting a three D show. Because why the hell not? But the thing is, the Patrick spinoff is gonna be two uh, D animation. Got it. Fever. Las Vegas? Damn it. Not just Viva. Fever. I know, it sounds like Viva. Now I'm just thinking of uh, Louie Tunes back in action with Bugs singing that. You remember that Looney Tunes show where it was like extreme and like action-y? Uh, 
Lunatics uh, Unleashed. Lunatics. Yes. The, a show no one remembers because it was so horrible. <laughs> Animaniacs made, made reference to it. Hey, we won. What don't the Animaniacs make reference to? Looks like I won. Disco King. What's wrong? No need to be so down about it. Kiryu san. Hmm? San? Kiryu san. You're awesome! W whoa! Oh, that's another good reaction. Hold on. And the stone cold face. And screen capped? <laughs> no, it's more than that. I. I love you, Heart. Uh, what? Uh -oh. Oh, uh, damn, damn it. That's also <laughs> just it's just blank expression with what? I think his facial muscles are capable of any other expression. Other than grumpy. Than just grump. How old is Kiryu? Even his here? ghost is grumpy. What were you saying, Dragon? How old is Kiryu here? I think Kiryu is 20 in this game and Majima is 23. Which, Majima does not look like a 23-year-old man. He's been through some shit, okay? I know, but still. <laughs> like, he was tortured for years, so, like, that just shaved years off of his life. No wonder uh, he looks like he's in his mid-30s. Uh, it's it's the eye patch. It makes him look way older. That, that's exactly what I was going to say, Dragon. Damn it. Everybody just steal my stuff tonight. <laughs> what did what you say? The eye patch makes him look older. Well, it kind of does. Yeah, you're both not wrong. Your footwork left it left me dizzy and weak in the knees. Uh, I'm glad I managed to impress you, but really, the way you work your hips too, so magnificent, uh, heart. Uh, why have the, right. Why have the thanks, I guess. Has been oddly lewd. God, you know, Kiryu embodies me talking to women, just like <laughs> uh, what do I say to this? I need it out quick. Someone make a distraction. <laughs> I think you have what it takes to become the top dancer in Kamurocho, Kiryu. Someday, you'll even beat... him. Him again. Yeah, Maharaja is greatest dancer. They say he's a dancer from Osaka. He only arrived recently, but he's already made a name for himself here. His moves are like a fire on the dance floor. Listen, you just pull a Shifu and make a dramatic exit. Oh, he's gy Oh, his gyrating hips were just dreamy. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Hold on, I need another one. <laughs> you just hear a ghost shriek running away from a guy in his underwear. <laughs> Wait, I swear, if it's Mr. Libido who they're talking about. So, um, highlight reels when? <laughs> uh, well, that, that, whenever I finish this game, I might go through the VODs and make a highlight reel of all the wackiness that has been throughout this entire series. <laughs> Such as the first, Mr. Lupita. It'll give me, a to, um, uh, give me a chance to, or an excuse to use that old thumbnail I had for this. <laughs> the, the first Mr. Lupita, like me and Moon, we just couldn't comprehend him. Oh... All they heard you guys heard from him was what? Uh, 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 <laughs> and, and then every time he showed up, we just looked at the chat and it was just smashing all over the place. <laughs> uh, Mr. Leo is definitely smashing. <laughs> I was kind of waiting for Tamo to do a smash. Did somebody say smash? There it is. No! <laughs> We're talking about the games, I know. You keep dancing your way ready to, the top. to smash, if you know what I mean. You keep dancing it. your way to the top, Kiryu, and you're bound to run into him sooner or later. But don't worry. When that time comes, I'll be in your corner. Uh, uh-huh. I'm sure I get it, but thanks. I'm not sure I get it, but thanks. Okay, Kiryu. Um, you have a dance? We have to dance Kiryu, again. I think you're... Kiryu just wouldn't have fun. He's like, why is this lady hitting on me? God, I had the charismatic presence of a brick. Why are so many women wanting to date me? Oh, it's because he's got a nice face. Tamo. Hmm. Have a sip. Damn it, dragon. Oh, yummy. <laughs> An amazing dancer from Osaka. I like to see what he can do. Better swing by the disco every so often. I won't have this emote much longer, but 
It's okay, because I just gotta give some to a different person, so I have another one. At, at this point, I need to commission someone to just make a Tamo Sip emote for our channel. I don't worry, I probably will for my own. It's just her pounding back like a, a beer mug. I do own a beer mug. And Rowdy is whining again. It's made of glass. What's your... I usually just drink soda out of it, though. Or chocolate milk. Chalky milk? Chalky milk. You know, it sounded like you were saying chalky milk for a second. It was just like, ugh! I mean, that's what you get when you drink Nesquik. <laughs> what is that guy's deal? It'll show you some chalky milk. Ah. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Nobody could beat him. I can. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Please, Tamo, I don't want to dry heave on stream. Okay. Uh, Nobody can beat him. I was definitely dry. What is this guy wearing? <laughs> we couldn't even keep up with him. That's all you got, then? Is, then what? Is that's that what's Majima? Past no, he's got two eyes. Oh. That's Majima if he joined a disco club instead of the Yakuza. That's what's passing for dance, the dancing in Tokyo these days. Pathetic. Is there anyone with a chance of beating him? Why do yeah. I hear boss music? Yeah, my brother and no one else. <laughs> oh, so you're approaching me? Well, I can't... Oh, so you're approaching Sorry. me? I can't dance disco without getting closer, then please, get as close as you would like. Uh, TBG, the stream's kind of crusty. Uh, yeah, it, it dropped a bit, but it should be fixed. I am. Uh, speaking of that, I've heard that, like, some of the frame rate issues you've been having and, like, the choppiness is actually just an X-Split thing. Of course, it would be an exploit thing. Like, pretty much everyone who uses exploit has these issues. Yeah, it's, it's nothing new, uh, and I wish they would actually fix this. But it seems to when have, I stream, uh, clean I stream on OBS. No, I want to know what kind of issues it'd be having. I tried OBS once, but I just really couldn't figure out everything, so I gave up on it and just used exploit. That's fair. And, Yesterday when I did uh, Smash Bros, trying to pyro some friends, when our friend Matt joined the call in Discord, for some reason it tanked my bitrate for a second. Yeah. Oh, my brother! Kiryu, I'm so glad you're here. What happened? Remember when I mentioned the greatest dancer in all at uh, Maharaja? I think so. Some guy from Osaka, right? Right, that's him. You <laughs> have three of these, Tamo? Four. Oh my god, Tamo. You just want to get all the sipping emotes, don't you? That last one's an otter. I don't know. I, I think the, the third one kind of encapsulate Tamo in, in sipping. The smugness. Just yeah. the, the smugness oozing from it. <laughs> Tamo also smug just needs my the uh, emote of Hacka for Smugface sipping something. That reminds me. His name is Ogida, and there's no question he's the best dancer in all of Camarocha right now. Huh? Is that right? Extraordinary dance sensibilities, outstanding rhythm, and otherworldly charisma. I hate to admit it, but he's a disco star in every way he can be. We couldn't even pull off the stuff he was throwing out, let alone look cool next to him. You're the only one who has a chance of bringing him down. You're Maharaja's last hope. Please, do this for us. As a, as the last and best of Tokyo's Maharaja dancers, you have what it takes to take... Uh, you have it to take this guy from the Osaka. What? Yeah, Me? Come on, you can't let some guy from Osaka waltz in here and claim that he's the best in Tokyo. He's rubbing it in our faces. You have to take a stand for Tokyo and put him in his place. Kiryu, I feel the same way. I think you're the dancer to in to you're the only dancer in Tokyo who has a chance of beating him. And if you were to beat him, Kiryu... Let's just say my love for you would get way much stronger. <laughs> that face! 
guess it's up to me then. I got to admit, I think I'm... he, uh... <laughs> I don't think he wants her love. <laughs> I know you do it. You can bet hey, we'll be cheering you from you. Hey, at least deal with Karen. True. Mm. Tamo! He's right, whether it's the streets or the disco, nobody- Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I threw in three sippies, and I didn't have, uh... I didn't actually drink the troops, so, uh, yeah. P please. I've caught up now. Save the sips for after we dance with this guy. Hey, you there. Hmm? Are you saying your moves are so great it'll make me thirsty? <laughs> that's... Please, don't... Please, for the love of God, don't take that out of context. I love me some good taste. <laughs> I'm curing you. I dance here at Maharaja. On behalf of Tokyo's dancers, I want to challenge you. Oh yeah? So, you're Kiryu, eh? Been hearing about you here and there. Where it is, you're a hotshot. Heh. <laughs> I wouldn't know. Accept my challenge and see for yourself. Oh yeah? So let me get this straight. When I beat you, I get to call myself the best dancer in Kamurocho with no more debating the issue. Is that right? You can do whatever you want if you beat me. Ha! A dance to the death, then. I dig it. Let's get down. All right, let's do this. Okay, you ready for Kemorojo's dance and title match? Yeah. Did you pick us all on normal? Yes, because I'm huh? insane. I could have gone hard and be been insane. If it's anything I've learned through this game, it's that your uh, that uh, rhythm games are not your strong point. It's the it's the sound delay. I need I need to actually hear it to keep with the rhythm, but with the second delay, it's hard to keep up. Ah! Uh. Good God! Look at that guy go! He's just new. He's just old new. Damn it, dragon! <laughs> <laughs> it's been clipped. Oh yeah, he's kicking my ass. Oh my god! He <laughs> Look at all that new. He is literally dancing circles around me. And the mini game. Almost twice your score. Oh, God. You approached him and, uh, bad move. Yeah, I know I got bad moves. Well, good thing this wasn't canon. I'm kind of sad that his little ghost thing doesn't not have giant, ugly yellow sunglasses on it. <laughs> what do you mean? Those are the best sunglasses. No, they don't have ladder, ladder shades to it. Were leather shades even a thing at this point? Well, this is the 90s. I'm not sure. I think that might have been early 2000s. No, I think this is the 80s. Isn't this the 80s? No, it's 90s. <laughs> I think it's late 90s, though. I'm surprised Rowdy is not bigger than the mic. Must be a good mic, then. Like, he is small, but he is loud. <laughs> Alright, this time we're going easy. I, I shudder to think what hard would look like with this guy. He would probably cover every single tile on the board before each and every single move. Probably. Instant transmissions. <laughs> I love the little strut dance move that's in this. Okay, I do like how uh, it considers your loss canon. So, so uh, Xplit makes an actual delay in the gameplay? Looks like it. There's like a, a second delay. 
That's probably why I don't have the issue because they used OBS. Yeah. That, and I think I also just listened to my audio right off my capture card, so. That's what I do. Oh, James. God, he is still pretty far ahead. Damn it, got too greedy. Damn it, it's too greedy again. Ah, damn it, what was my score compared to his? I think it was a thousand short. Yeah, it was. Oh, wow. He almost doubled my score again. That was on easy. I got an achievement? What? Say you want to dance? Complete every disco song on any difficulty. Surprised I didn't dance to that song. I thought I did. <laughs> yeah, you're playing on Xbox or Mines, May. And I need to rate a little about this because it's really irritating. Yes. So. I'd play, so like, I'm gonna talk about a game real quick that, um, I enjoyed in my childhood. And had two sequels. Okay. Right. It was on the original Xbox. And then I think on the Xbox 360 for uh, the sequel. Fallout Brothers the sequel the wasn't sequel. nearly as good. No. Fable. Ah, <laughs> uh, Fable. Yeah. I played Fable 1. I played Fable 2. And I've heard nothing but bad things about Fable 3, but, like, recently I saw someone playing it a little bit and actually enjoying it, so I'm like, hmm, maybe I'll make my own opinion about it. Oh, dear. Turns out, it's impossible to obtain on PC legally. Oh, wait. The only way to play it is to own an Xbox One uh, and to purchase it on the online store. Is that on Game Pass? It is on Game Pass, but only for console. It is not available for PC in any legal form whatsoever. The hell? And I hate it when this kind of thing happens. Apparently it's something to do with licensing, but like, Microsoft owns it, so like, I don't see why they'd have a licensing issue. I'm, I'm currently pissed off about a Kingdom Hearts PC release being only on the Epic Game Store. Okay, yeah, we're, we're canceling. Uh, actually, we could make a comeback. And, uh... I say that, and I'm screwing up the button presses. Each game in the series is 60 bucks on PC. Mm-hmm. Like, why? Here's the thing I've noticed about, like, Japanese games on PC. No matter how old they are, the price never drops. Ever. Like, Kingdom Hearts 1 is nearly 20 years old, I think. Yeah, I don't think the Japanese believe in decreasing their prices based on age. Yeah, no, I, already, I can already get all those games on Game Pass as easily, and I already own, own 1.5 and 2.5 on, on my PS3. Okay, I think that's enough dancing for now. Like, I remember seeing a game on that it's been on Steam for, like, I think it was like 10 years, it's still full price. What game is that? I don't remember. Yeah, well, speaking of deals, I got uh, Unravel for 5 bucks on Steam. Oh, nice. <laughs> Alright, I'm done dancing. I need to go punch people now. At least okay, uh, this I'm dancing going... thing, we did get some good reactions from Kiryu. <laughs> I uh, I do at least have something uh, planned for tomorrow or Sunday, depending on when it comes in, because uh, the, the London the London Skyline Lego kit I got isn't going to be in until near the end of the month. Mm -hmm. But the Bowser Castle kit should be in tomorrow or Sunday, Ooh. so I will be doing that soon. And I spent right. 111 bucks on it. You madman. And people say I'm bad with money. Uh, I spent 235 bucks on another Lego kit beforehand. 
Yeah, you bought the you is. bought the NES yeah. thing. Yeah, the TV and NES kit. All right. Where exactly do I need to go? Kiryu, do you got any ideas? And the plan was to stream that. I wanted my first video kit, but I didn't realize so freaking massive it was gonna be. All right, guess not. I guess maybe I need to go to the real estate agency. Where is it? Oh, it's down there. this music oh it's funky did marina leave the radio on oh that girl hmm how am i supposed to turn this thing off does this do not see a power button kiryu kiryu is bad with technology you need to understand, he's a very simple boy. Whoa! What's this? Guess I changed the channel on the radio. Wait a minute. It's the radio show that Majima was listening to back in his uh, story. Is Kiryu going to hear one of Majima's stories? Oh, I hope. As always, we kick off the show with shoutouts to our faithful listeners by reading their postcards. This guy's as cheesy as it gets. I need to turn this off before he gets in my head. Nope, not Majima. Oh, my. I think I listen to your show all the time. I think this is the same one. I have a girlfriend I adore, but this morning at breakfast, we got into a huge fight. and not sound like a complete part of anyone's morning. Yeah, this is the same one. So, I'm so gonna guess this one... Yeah, time. it was at the same time. But the thing is, is Kiryu also gonna send in one of the stories? Possibly. So, if you already listened to this, we might as well just skip through it. What? A million yen?! Ah, uh, it's that time already? Too bad, too sad. But that's our show for today, folks. Alright then, make sure to tune in again. Goodbye, and see you next time. What in the world is going on? If they read three of your postcards on the air, you'll win something worth a million yen? Make sure to rethink the values of things. I mean, a postcard about fried eggs got used on a show. Maybe even I could write something. Kiryu you looks so pissed. Like, more than usual. Yeah. Why was it eggs? Why couldn't it have been bacon? Oh, Mr. President, you're here. Mm oh, where were you? You left the radio on. Oh, I'm sorry. I went out to buy some office supplies like pens, paper clips, and postcards. What? Postcards? Why? Do you have something against postcards? Oh, no. I was just thinking I wanted some postcards. Jeez, ah. Kiryu, no need, be so, no need to be so intense. Remember, in intense is like Kiryu's middle name. What's his Remember, last name? Kiryu. His first name's Kaz Kazuma. Oh. Yeah, everyone Kazuma just goes... Kiryu. Yeah, but everyone just ca calls him by his last name, like how Majima's, Majima's last name and his first name's Goro. Oh, okay. There's something I can write about. Maybe I should try sending in a postcard. Oh, God. I just wrote something. Oh, dear. Mario's last name is Mario, so you never know if you're saying his first name or last name. Oh, no. What, what's in this corner? Why is there a card inside the office? Who left this here? 
Was it you? Before you see I... a man in his underwear, quickly flee. <laughs> Quick, tear up the card. Alright. I know what we need to go with for a pen name. I heart Nishki. Hmm. This is tough. I bet Nishiki would be good at coming up with something snappy sounding like Nishikiyama, Nishiki, maybe just I heart Nishiki. Wait, what? I think I just creeped myself out. I need a different <laughs> approach. <laughs> Alright, do we want... Cause, uh, I think Judgment Kazi should be our name. Wasn't Dark Angel one of Majima's options? I, I, I think it was Dark Angel. Majima. <laughs> Damn it. It should be the base off something I like. Favorite food, favorite color. Hmm. Now those strike me, strike a chord. Favorite song, Judgment. That's it. Judgment Kazi will do. Do you have time to write down and write a postcard? All right, what story should we go with? Because I think we did a good number of side stories with Kiryu. All right, so we got the the quest for Arth Q3, which was to beat up the entire town to get a video game back for a kid. Undercover in Kamurocho, I believe that one was one of the earlier ones where we had to buy a gun off like a weapons dealer. Yokimichi Silver, that was that was the band that we uh, helped motivate. A lesson in SNF. Oh God, I remember that one. I'm having, <laughs> I'm having non-flashbacks. I think they do the TV producer one. Being a TV producer, that, that one was good. Yeah. Girlfriend with a secret, and that's the one where the where that guy's girlfriend was selling her underwear to creeps. So we should be a TV so, uh, producer. Yeah. So remember the game I talked about where you're mountain climbing for the Oculus? Yes. Its sequel is out. Ooh. And I'm getting it right now. I'll write about helping out the TV location shoot as a producer. Now, let's see. There. Boy. Hey, Marina. Can you mail this postcard for me? Oh, sure. Of course. But, uh, whatever you do, don't read it. Of course not. Why would I? Never, ever read it. Oh, for crying out loud. I won't. I hope they choose my postcard. Better tune in to Doyce Kamiya's radio show next time I check. So, I wonder if, based off of how you do in the sub-story, it gets uh, checked on the radio. I guess I need to leave and come back. Alright, what do we got? Alright, something nice I really like about the uh, Oculus app mm -hmm. is you get a game off of it, and your uh, Oculus is turned on and connected to it. It'll automatically start downloading the game you just bought. Ah, cool. Ability rank, supportability. You've already invested in that. I still can't believe that fucking Karen is a gold rank. I can't believe it either. Like, why is she a gold rank? Does I don't know. I'm gold concerned. Gold rank for what? The uh, Majima Sting. Alright. The Cabaret. Yeah, the Cabaret. Alright, well, while we're collecting some money with uh, the, the team, might as well head back out and see if I can buy up some more property. I actually don't remember. It's been so long since we played as Kiryu. We got 57 million yen on us. Oh no. Is this who I think it is? Oh, it's you. Didn't I see you at Queen Ayu's, uh, Ayusama's dungeon? Oh, right. With Ayu the Dominatrix. What was your name? Ayu calls me Masochistic Man. A pig, a slave, and I... I, I see. Thank you for I your help. I feel like I missed out on something on one of the streams. Uh, we helped out a Dominatrix become more assertive. Just another day in Camarocho. Thank you, help. Thank you for your help in the playroom the other day. I well help. Since that day, Ayu has reached a whole new level as a dominatrix. Perhaps it's thanks to you. 
Th that's great. With no words to express my humblest gratitude to you. So, instead of words, I would like to thank you with deeds. Deeds? Word on the street is that you're running a business. I thought perhaps I'd be able to use my skills f from my day job as a consultant to serve. I mean, help you. Whoa, you're a consultant? I never would have guessed, but sure, I'd love to get your help. People have all sorts of uh, kinks. You more, never know what to expect. The more straight-laced you are on the streets, the more likely you are to be a freak in the sheets. The masochistic man has joined your team as an advisor. Oh, joy. He's good with business and love, duh. But he sucks with food, shopping, and activities. This is wonderful. I'm looking forward to serving you. Please make me squeal, squeal like a pit little piggy. Sure, you do realize you're not even trying to hide your freak flag right now, right? I guess it doesn't matter. Just as long as you stay all the way over there, and I'm over here. Just don't summon Mr. Libido. Oh, don't worry. The, the, the sex shop is all the way down here. No, that's Shogi. I don't remember where it is. Uh, I guess we could go talk to Baracus and see if we can get some more fighting techniques. You just must utter his name three times. Libido. 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 Actually, his name was like Habu or something like that. Yeah, I think it's like Habu. I just call him Mr. Libido. Habu. 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 You cold? <laughs> How can I take down blade-wielding enemies? Okay, knives are dangerous weapons, boy. I lost some very someone very dear to me because of a knife attack. Is that why you're always telling me to be careful of them? Yes. You can train and fight all you want, but anyone can be killed easily with a, when a weapon's involved. Sad but true. That's why it's time I taught you to move a move to take down enemies wielding knives. It's funny this guy looks like a homeless drunk and he's named after the Roman god of wine. <laughs> but simply, the idea is to break the arm holding the weapon. That sounds savage. The move is a trademark of a pretty d famous street fighter back in, in the States. He even had a saying. Knives take lives. You want to do some harm? Prepare to lose an arm. I call it the blade arm mash. I thought the move came from a famous street fighter. How can how come you got a name for it? Oh, come on, boy. Don't get hung up on the little details like that. Bacchus, I presume. Looks like we have a guest. More like a tumbleweed. Don't judge by appearances, boy. We have ourselves a real threat here. This won't be your average street fight. Clever of you to sense there's more to me than meets the eye. Still, running would have been the smart thing to do, if you could, that is. Dagnabbit. What are you so afraid of, Brockus? You usually seem pretty confident around these guys. Boy? Is he now? I have no idea what you're talking about, but I guarantee we're going to have a wonderful time. Now get over here so I can skewer you. Do you guys want to feel old? Hell no. Mario Kart 7 came out almost 10 years ago. What came out almost 10 years ago? Mario Kart 7. Wow. Huh. Shatter the arm of enemy wielding a one-handed blade. Show no mercy. Press Y when the enemy is about to attack with one-handed. So it's a heat move. Not a whole lot of time, though, because knives are fast. Uh, excuse me, Kiryu. Can you also do this as Majib Wait, uh, later? Oh, that- that's- that's a- OOH! NO! Mm. <sighs> no. Please, no, never do that again. My mouth hurts now. Up, <laughs> uh, moon, too tired. Uh, uh, if, if you need to go to bed, you know what you have to do. Uh huh. All right, good night, moon. Good night. Good night, moon.
There's Bike. Wow. I knew this would be a violent cycle, but this is ridiculous. Alright, I got a trolley. Just introduce him to the trolley of pain. I tried. The most important thing is you tried. I can't believe you threw a trash can at him. What do I have in terms of heat? Health boost, health and heat. That's yeah. not all the heat that's going on in this town. What are you doing here, Nanshou Tabori? I am everywhere and nowhere. You can call me Shodage's libido. Well, we ran to Habu at his Kyrie before. True. More direct, at least. I have to stop the cycle of violence, Kitty. You good? I got your cycle of violence right here! That was pretty damn violent, if I say so myself. Ow. God, you messed up my arm, man! Repeatedly. Blaze may be your thing, but you won't be holding one for a while. Get out of here and straighten up your life. Uh. It reminds me of the, the Obi-Wan scene where it's just like, you want to go home and rethink your life, although with more arm breaking. So, uh, Ninjala Season 4 uh, tournament registries are open. Ooh. I'll have to check that out after stream. And now it's that I don't have to worry about... Bubble Battle. What was that? It's Bubble Bob. Battles. Ooh, not great. You know, I got I got people to punch. Oh, I'm it's oh, these are Dojima people. Oh, they have different fighting styles. Neat. Yeah, although I'm not as much as it, this is a good crowd clearer. I'm not a fan of Beast because you just move so slow as Kiryu. I'm kind of a, a a fan of the brawler style, just because you it, you're fast, but also do decent damage. Kyrio uh, smash, Bunga uh. Bunga. Although I think Rush was also oh. good. But it's not as athletic as Majima's pink style. Yeah, th unfortunately, it's not. Which, you'd think that Kirio would have a style like that. Because he looks significantly younger. <laughs> Don't throw out your hip, old man. I mean, he's younger than Majima in this game, in, the, in this series. Yes. Right, he also uh, looks, he looks like half Majima's age. Wow, we got 35, he's much uh, old. 35 CP, we need to pay a visit to Bob. Bob? Yes, Bob. Hello. Hi, Bob. <laughs> Hi. What are you doing out of the Ice Age? Oh, I just thought I'd thought myself out again. <laughs> Bob's like a little way. guy called John Basson. Is, is Bob the clown? Yeah, Bob's the clown. Yeah, Bob's the clown. And you know, you kind of need money to live in this era. <laughs> so I found work as a as a shrine clown. I didn't even know those were a thing. Throw money over hey, why do pound honk the noises? Oh, we don't have hearts, so it's how we pump our blood. Honk, honk. Honk. You deserved it. Ow. I need a place to lay low until Tachibana sends word where, though. I figured the place to lay low would be at work. You want to know something sad? What? Um, you're, like we all know about it and Pennywise, right? Yeah. Um, that the popularity of uh, of it caused uh, you know, a bunch of uh, killer clowns in media. Mm -hmm. oh. Wait, what? And it destroyed an industry. 
Are you saying it killed the clown industry? Yes. Wow. That's why clowns are so rare these days. They used to be like a massive industry. They used to be like it used to be respectable to go to clown school. There used to be clown school. Oh no, money <laughs> money battle. You wow, know, that guy was like a smug douche. We we lost someone? What? We lose. Oh no, you lost shares. I, I honestly have no idea who we lost. Alright, what am I supposed to be doing here? Manage the whole curious office. You can also check in the status properties. Collect assign a manager to and secure to each area. Send advisors to properties. Uh, certain power collection, real estate, uh, collection points. Let's see that. Collect properties. Uh, money battle. Sometimes when you collect your profits, one of the five billionaires will challenge you to a money battle. The manager assigned to the area will try to counter the effects of the billionaire's aggressive investment, but if their HP runs out, you will lose the targeted property. Protect your property by pressing A to invest your own money to restore the manager's HP. Oh, we lost the... Uh, we lost the place. <laughs> so what's the whole thing you do of Kiryu then if Majima is the uh, cabaret? Uh, this is it. So like, how does this work then? Because I know it's real estate, right? Uh, it's a lot more confusing than, than the cabaret is. It's more management based. If it's the cabaret, which is a legit mini game. Yeah. This one's more of you actually do need to invest in more properties and then you need to have the people go to them and make sure you don't lose the properties. It, it's like a, a big headache. But it apparently, this is a, uh, you need to complete these stories and beat like the billionaires for Kiryu and the other cabaret owners as Majima to unlock their final fighting style. It's Monopoly. I'll make an offer in cash. He's so convincing he didn't even need to meet the owner. He just presented it to the building itself. That smug look at the end. You know, the I'll make an offer in cash is a pretty good like use of, uh, for an alert. Could be for like donations. All right, Mine is just Wario popping out of uh, Game Boy points flying everywhere. You know, I might do something like that and might change the animation. Oh. Oh, right, our old place. Hmm. The Kazuma family office. But if Kashiwagi took me in now, the Kazuma family would officially betray Patriarch Do Dojima. All it does is make trouble for kashiwagi san I can't come running to him to, for help this time. I honestly thought that was Nishiki stumbling up to me for a second there. Well, it's just not Hobo sneaking up on you. <laughs> Wait a second. Is that... Is it these two again? From the I, beginning of the game? I, I think these are the two uh, accountants that visited the Grand earlier in the game. So Majima and Kiryu eventually meet up, right? Well, yeah, they they're they're like bro or they're like uh, best friends in the well complicated best friends later in the series. Relationship status. It's complicated. <laughs> Can you just go one day without getting yourself hurt, Kiryu? I swear. 
No, he's Kiryu. Oh, it's Reina. You know, knowing that, uh, in Spanish, that name means queen, I have a very, I have a certain perspective of what she might be like. And what's that? Like I said, her name in Spanish means queen. All high and mighty, then? You know, uh, the, uh, the laugh and all that. Oh, the oh ho ho laugh? Yes. God, I had a fucking enough of that laugh in Omori. Like, I tried reading it so much, but it's like, a, it got to the point a lot of times, like, holy shit. <laughs> I think the only one of us who can really pull off that laugh would be Moon. Mostly because I've actually heard her pull off that laugh before. I've and tried. You, more, you better have a way to do it a lot in one part of the game. Oh god. I'm not too good at it. I'll probably practice it more though. Let's just say the person she's gotta do it for is pretty obnoxious. Mm. Go to Serena. What's that? Go to work? Got it. <laughs> I I gotta uh, put some people into the new property we bought, so I might as well. Alright, staff listing. Leisure, leisure. Alright, uh, let's invest in this place. What do we got? Bad. I forget, is triangle good or is circle better? I have no idea. Because there's two sort. Right, let me go back to the help. See. Economic influence. Emma, what are you doing? All right. Each advisor has different abilities in the area of expertise. So select the right advisor for each property. Okay. So I just looked up for you. Double circle is great. Circle is good. Triangle is okay. X is bad. Okay, that's good to know. When you invest in a place, it affects how much the progress bar fills up. Alright, so... Best person for this property would be... Uh, her. And Kyo can invest in the Pachinko area because he's got double circle. What do you mean, Konami's headquarters? Yes. Problem solving is good. This just looks like you're doing in-game taxes. It feels like I'm doing in-game taxes. <laughs> Lots of bookkeeping. He's the best security we have right now. I'll bear back. Don't okay. do Mr. <sighs> Libido without me. Uh, don't worry, I won't do Mr. Libido, period. I don't want to. <laughs> habu. 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 Stop it. All right, profit <laughs> forecast is 10 million. I think we should wait a little bit, Don't though. Don't me right now. I'm in the zone. <laughs> so I'm I'm starting to get the, the Hain of Kiryu's thing. It's not as fun as Majima's is, though. Because Majima is more hands-on. And Majima's has the funky music. Yeah. And Kiryu has elevator music. Majima's got the saxophone. Habu comes here. Did somebody say saxophone? Oh, God damn it. Is that that kind? I play a mean saxophone. I can't do that voice. Only Q 
only Tamo can pull it off. I play a mean saxophone. What's this place? Nope, nothing to invest here. I wish there was a good indicator to tell what places are investable, like the ones with the signs in front of them, that means you can invest in it. I guess well, maybe... can you also see it on the, on the map? Nope, they just look like gray buildings. I, we might be able to get like an, in, uh, an inventory thing that we can use that show what our investments. But that's not probably till much later. I, I gotta head out because I do have to get up at like 5 since I have to leave for something at 7. Alright. Okay. Night, guys. Good night. No higher? All right. ちゃんと来てくれたのね、キリュウさん。あまり長いはしない。立花とおどくから連絡が来るまでだ。それまでの間、頼む。もちろん。座って。とにかく頭の傷、レナ。今。なんだか、すごく怖い顔してたけど。そうだ。ならよかった。傷、そこまで深くはないみたい。消毒だけするわ。ああ。さっき、キリュウさん、西木山君と兄弟の縁を切ったって言ってたよね。それって彼を巻き込みたくないからなんでしょ今の俺は道島組全員に追われてる。あいつはもう俺と関わらない方がいい。そんなことだと思った。結局あなたたちってお互いを自分の身以上に思ってる。西木山君がうちに来るときいつもあ
It looks like they tailed him to his uh to his office. Kiryu and Majima are not having a good night. What happened to your fifty seven million? Oh, I invested. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, there were more places I could invest into. Was this game on PC? I think so. It's on Steam. Okay. Also, Dragon had to go for the night, so it's just us now. Yay. Oh, Yakuza Zero. Yakuza Zero is only $20. And gift? Too bad I don't have that much to spare right now. What do you mean, gift? Nothing. Well, if you want to, I'll allow it considering my birthday's coming up. But just this once. Alright, so let's see. Get all the Yakuza games. <laughs> I will still call you crazy, but I will allow this. You can actually get all the uh, the Kwame games for uh, Yakuza Zero and both Kwame games for only sixty bucks right now. Or well, sixty three, but still. Both Kwame games. The Kwame games are full on remakes of Yakuza One and Two. Ah. And there's Yakuza Three remastered, Four remastered, Five remastered, and Like a Dragon. And Dead Souls. The game that there, that's almost a lot killed, of Yakuza. Oh, the game that almost killed Yakuza in the West. That is a lot of Yakuza. Oh, great. More people to punch. So, I'm more about that Fable 3 thing that annoys me. It looks like I'll never get to play it. Unless I start looking a bit like Majima, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean. It's gonna cost you an eye to get it? No, just... Who else wears eye patches? Uh... Big Boss? This is true. Oh boy, more people to punch. That's a lot of people to punch. Don't worry. I got a workaround for it. Hold on. I do need to heal up a little bit, though. So let's go. Nice health. Let's see. I'll eat a bento. Nom, 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 nom. No, no. Ow. Oh, get up. Cure you, please. Get up. Oh, he's got a, a stun gun. Taser. That's a word. Both work. Oh, wait, for some reason that reminds me to... Like something else. Alright, why is it not let me do my heat move? Do I need... Oh, I might need, like, three bars. Okay. So... I'd heard, uh... UI being referred to being in, like in reference to uh, what I always thought was called a HUD. It looks like it's a bit interchangeable. Wait, what is UI and HUD? Ah, uh, 
even though the HUD, is, even though it's really like the HUD is part of the UI, it's. I've been wondering what the difference was for years because I've had people try and correct me, like that's not the HUD, that's the UI, like you know, health bars and whatnot, which are in fact the HUD. Pick up the knife, carry you. Yeah, maybe next week. So what's Yakuza a zero, like in timeline wise? Is it like a prequel to the entire series? Yeah, or? this is the introductory, uh, the introduction to the entire series. Okay. But it was made after a lot of the series, right? Yep. Oh, oh god, taste it to the back of the neck! Oh, that is not a good place to get zapped. No, it is not. <laughs> you zapped him so hard he started planking. <laughs> also, Kiryu never killed anybody. D don't just ignore the guy we just shanked right in the back alley. Oh, he's fine. He knows a good doctor. He wasn't bleeding blood, he was bleeding money. He was- that was, uh, uh apple juice. <laughs> with red food- with, uh, red dye number 511. <laughs> just ignore that lifeless body in the background. He's just... sleeping. I'm sorry, there is no 511. Uh, there's red 40. There we go. <sighs> Great, I see a motorcycle, so at least I got that. Ah, damn it, Nishiki. Huh. Apparently Skittles are banned in some countries. Hmm. Because they contain food dyes that uh, have adverse effects on young children. Oh, and Kuze's here too. So anything with those dyes has to have a warning label. Hmm. And are banned for infants. Oh, all the bosses are here. feed an infant Skittles anyway, but you know. Yeah. Given how people can be people sometimes, though, I won't be surprised if someone tried to feed an infant Mountain Dew. I'm sure someone has. Probably in Florida. It's always Florida. Florida. <laughs> I wonder if one day we'll see a headline like Florida man behind bars for feeding Mountain Dew to baby. One of my favorite things to do is Google your name, but then put Florida man there and see what wacky like crime happened that day. Or Google your birthday. Oh, yeah. The best one I found um, was actually kind of lame. Oh my god, how many times do I need to teach you this lesson, old man? Hold on. Hold on. Give me a minute. I need my motorcycle. Bonk. Oh, here's one. Pregnant Florida woman reportedly stabs her Florida man for looking at photo of another woman. Huh.
Here, I got something for you to sign! Alright, you know what? Bat the Brawler, it's just Kuze at this point. I usually don't punch Maybe people I'm with glasses, but this time I'll make an exception! Maybe I'm just doing it wrong, but Florida seems to be, like, extremely chill around my birthday. <laughs> There's almost no results at all for my for like March 9th. Damn it! I want I wanted to pour hot tea on his face, but unfortunately, that is not going to be an option. Well, yeah, he just kicked you in the butt, like literally. How dare! There, just stab him. Just throw a cone at him. I tried to make him a cone head. <laughs> Better than a pyramid head. Also, thank you for the thing. You're welcome. Happy birthday. Thank you. His early gift, but yes. Now, hopefully, this uh, this thing can run it okay. Wait, what? Are you wait, wedding me or the game? <laughs> wow, he drives like me. Your insurance company must love you. Oh, it's Tachibana. I, I I think he just broke every bone in Kuze's body at this point. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna block this car with my body. Oh no, how t could that fail? I'm just going to try shooting at that car, even though it's a really fast target, and I will probably not hit anything worth a damn. I just found it funny in games that, like, if you shoot a vehicle enough, it just explodes. The only explanation I can think of that is, like, you hit the gas tank or something. True, but it doesn't matter where you where you actually hit it; it'll just explode. <laughs> True. Thanks, video games. <laughs> Even if you hit the gas line and manage to shoot and like create a spark that just lit the gas on fire, the whole car wouldn't explode. It'd probably just combust. It just spontaneously combust. Well, I guess that is a form of explosion, just everything's on fire all of a sudden. You're not wrong. Speaking of fire... What? Speaking of fire, I was, um... I was playing Vermintide with some friends recently. And I was called, like, the embodiment of this is fine. <laughs> because, like, things, like, utter chaos will be happening all around me, and I'll just be like, oh, hey, a grenade. It's like, oh, hey, a bomb. <laughs> I'm just looting while everyone's just murdering everything. <laughs> it honestly sounded like you were saying you were just looting while everybody was murdering everything. Well, you know, that's half my brand. <laughs> I'm going to be referring to my brand as cuteness and lewdness. Just because they kind of rhyme, maybe, a little bit. But we all know it's actually smug. Oh, 
私があなたならそんなことは気にしません私はね桐生さん自分の周りにいる人間は全て利用すればいいと思っています私の育ってきた環境では誰もがそうしていましたそうでなければ生き残れないしのし上がっていくこともできません彼でも何でも使っていかに周りの人間を利用するかだけを考えるんですこれはあなたのようなアマチャには遠い世界の話でしょうけどねだがさっき俺を助けに来たのは俺を利用するためってしてきた結果として金と力を持つようになりましたどうも私にはその方面の才能があったようですただしあなたと違って私には私のために命を張るような仲間はいません Yeah, that would be a little hard to make friends. No, part of me was thinking, oh, it's going to reveal he got shot here. I shall abandon the car here. Uh, no, you're not. <laughs> Wow, that was chapter 9? Really? 50 million yen? Yeah. Or 29 times the Prime Minister's monthly salary. Nice. What is a man's worth? Uh... 
Is it in his possessions, or the friends he's made along the way? For Kyu, both. Yeah, why not both? <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot he had a prosthetic arm. Daijobunoka, それで人造がうまいことを動かなくなった。社長の腕を落としたのはその頃敵対してた中国人マフィアともでね。もちろん落とし前は俺がつけた。カタギの話にはいい。ああ、ジュース。昔の話にはいい。Yeah. If I remember correctly, I think that's like having to get your blood pumped. Yeah, they couldn't get a transfusion in time. Yeah, I said have a machine clean his blood for him. <laughs> no pun intended. Intend your pun, coward! さえ必要なかったろうな。それで、これからどうする。全部社長が目覚ましたからのことだ。安心しな。ここは神室町の中で唯一登場会の目が届かない場所でね。アジア会って呼ばれてる。聞いたことないか。アジア会。この界隈に
Well, my steam derped and had to die, so... I forgot I can't um, download something on Steam and watch a stream at the same time. Mm. So I kept trying to go into the downloads, and Steam was like, nah, I'm not going to let you click on anything, ever, at all. <laughs> and so it had to die. Oh, you save it a phone? にくびっといわんしまうわいけ。いいはぶどうさんじゃない。女性は万事とにを金銭解決。そうだ。ああ、気にしなくていい。味上がりはお前を考慮するってさ。なんて言っても信じねえか。そうだ。ああ、それより
ハルショウ。社長。立花。あんた。もういいのか。新さん。お騒がせしています。小田さん。新さんは一度下した決断を変える方じゃありません。私たちもアジア外にいる以上、そのことをわきまえておくべきです。ここに桐生さん、角間
They had to wait for him to snore. Wait, is that? Oh no, Tamo. Hmm. Yes. It's him, but another him. Oh, it's a different Mr. Libido. Yeah. So I guess he does need a different voice. Nah. I bet she's a virgin. I can smell it. I like how you had to contemplate it for a second there. Hey. We libidos are a hive mind. We all speak with one voice. <laughs> and it gives us super strength. Oh, hey there. We keep running into each other here. You really spend all your time at places like this, huh? <laughs> Guilty as charged, officer. You know, at least this one still wears his clothes. Now pin me down and handcuff me. Oh, God. <laughs> anyway, how's it going with the telephone cards? Show me what you've got, handsome. Uh... Okay. Uh, no, get that saxophone out of here. Whew. All these girls are super hot. Which one's your favorite? Well, I don't really have one. <laughs> yeah, right. You need to be shy, you big old horn dog. We're both grown men. Tell me what you really do. <sighs> Fine. I guess if I had to pick one, it'd be her. Well, that's a little freaky. <laughs> huh? Doesn't she look like the girl from that store? Hmm? Hey, it does look like her. But, you know, with, like, tentacles and shit? Wait, what? You're one kinky guy, cutie. What? Oh, boy. Thinking of her is getting me excited. Uh, uh. <laughs> it's so quiet. Uh, it's coming to me. I see it. <laughs> I feel so dirty. <laughs> and I'm, th I'm not the one saying this. I don't. <sighs> it went took a little work. You're telling me you really saw it? You saw her naked? <laughs> oh, got you curious? I didn't say that. I just don't see how that's possible. It's called imagination and lots of hentai. You just have to train your mind. If you looked at a photo so long you burned holes in it, you'd be able to do the same with anything else. Hmm. All right, break's over. It's high time to gaze upon some girls in the flesh. Later, Gator. I need a shower. I was starting to, I was starting to give him a bit more of a posh voice <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> oh, it's a different one, so each one has its own, like, voice. Maybe I could make him sound like a European aristocrat. Oh, yes. Indubitably. Indubitably. My good horny chum. <laughs> yes, I'm going with that. Wow, I have nothing. I'll wait till I get more money. I really want to get that fishing pole, but it is 30 million. The killer bee <gasps> is 50 it's million. Killer bee? It, it's a <laughs> secret wallet. Yeah. Can make pocket circuit cards sure to attract attention. 
What's up with the secret wallet? I think it's if I fight Shakedown, then I don't lose as or it. I think it's I don't lose as much money if I lose a fight. What does it look like a fanny pack? It's like one of those slim wallets. Uh. Well, here's how you don't lose that a, a whole lot of money against Mr. Shakedown. Just don't get hit. Hmm? Just activate your Dark Souls skills. Uh, speaking of Shakedown. Uh, he's got oh, a... Oh, dear. 103 million? I can't Are you ever... stealing his money? Yes. I'm just going to rob him blind while he's sleeping. Do it. So many button presses. It's I good. have to spam the button. I wish there was a, cha a way for you to steal more from him, but you can only steal a thousand at a time. That's a lot of thousands. Yeah. At this rate, it'd be better just to beat him up. It'd be faster. So why don't you, like, sucker punch him while he's asleep? Well, Kiryu's nothing if not courteous. Ah, uh, you can't. Wait, you'll pickpocket him while he's asleep, but you won't sucker punch him. Well, yeah, that, that'd be rude. <laughs> don't want to wake someone up while they're sleeping. Yeah. Why you see it? Show the same courtesy that others great can give to you. Alright. Back to work. I don't think we're gonna do any more story stuff tonight just because we don't really have a whole lot of time left, so I think I'm gonna dedicate it to doing some of the real estate stuff. Oh boy, real estate. in the health plaza and that's about it Dosan As always, we kick off the show with a shout out to our faithful listeners by reading their postcards. Come on, Dos. Read a postcard from Judgment Kazi. Teenager Forever Son. Oh, it's time already? Too bad. Too sad. But that's our show for today, folks. All right, then, make sure to tune in again. Goodbye, and see you next time. My postcard didn't make the cut. Better luck next next time. I come right again. Hmm, now what to write about? I know. The hottest band sweep in the nation. I'll write about meeting the Yokimichi Silvers without giving any secrets away. Now, let's see. There. He writes like a machine. Alright, let's see how real estate is doing. Oh, 
real estate. So it's the minus two and the more of like minus one at the far right when you're uh, looking at that stuff. Uh, let's see. Starting PL collection. Let's see. No, not that. Not that. Not that. Economic influence. The show's manager's effect on the economic trends in the area. The higher the value, the better. The number on the left is the starting value, and the one on the right is the final one. All four collections. Safety influence, higher value. So yeah, just try your best to keep the, the value high. Hmm. So the more you collect, the worse the number, I guess. Yeah. So you have to swap them out every so often? Yeah, I think you have to swap them out. Uh, unlike, uh, Majima, where it's like, oh, they get tired if they keep doing it too much. This one's just, oh, there's probably people more suited to each of the areas. Alright, there has to be some places I can invest over here. Alright, so it's everything in this, like, little cluster right here. Let's go over there and see if there's anything I can invest in. I'm just trying to think of places that look like they stand out. Yep, nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Come on, there has to be something I can work with. Nope. Nah, not the not the pizza place. I wish I could invest in it. Unfortunately, I can't. Aww. Can you invest in a maid cafe? Maybe. Probably not in this uh, sector, but I'm sure there's probably one around here somewhere. Or maybe in another game. And I can't go that way. So great. Uh, no, wait, that's uh, that's a Cosmo family one. All right, I guess I've invested in every place that I can. Oh, wait, here's a place. Oop. Hello, small child. What are you doing out here? Hello, here. tiny crotch spawn. Why are you here? <laughs> Can I invest in this park? This is a very nice park. I think from this point on, any street fights I get into is just going to be Dojima family members.
Oh, this is... Oh, it's the secretary. C cut it out! Hmm? Uh -huh. Shut the hell up, woman. Like I said before, I want to see that Kiryu man, or whatever his name is. Hurry it up! <laughs> like I already told you, he's not here now. Hey, I'm right here. What do you want? Mr. President. Oh, you're the president? Wait a minute. You. I bumped into you on the street before, right? Heh. <laughs> so you're President Kiryu, eh? And you're the leisure cane, so what do you want with us? I got better things to do than reminisce with you. Hey now. It come to my turf and mess with my business? That's all you gotta say for yourself? Where are your manners, man? I don't see what your problem is. I'm running a legit business here. Don't you get it? I'm telling you, this is my problem. So what's this about? <laughs> Beating around the bush isn't my style. If you get my way, I'll get a little visit from my boys. You remember what happened to Yo uh, Yamo uh, Yamanoi, right? Hmm. You're rotten to the core. I can't let you keep a stranglehold on this area. <laughs> I'll shut your pie hole right up now so you don't, can't give me any lip like that. Hey, Tak Takashita. Sir. Why don't you educate this idiot president? Yes, sir. Don't blame me if you end up dead, asshole. <laughs> and he runs like a coward. Oh, he's got a taser. Oh, he's got a knife, too. Alright, but you know what? I've got a bike! Ah. Give me that arm. Ooh, what is this? Oh, that's salt! Oh, right in the eyes. Yeah. Just stomp on my nuts. The cycle of violence continues. And it'll continue for now and forever. Wow, this guy is so resilient! Not anymore, though. You just beat him up with a bicycle. And your fists. Heh, <sighs> 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 Takashita doesn't stand a chance, eh? Not bad, not bad. Looks like you can wa walk the walk. You know what? I think I'll let you off the hook today. But if you let <coughs> me off again, you're dead meat. I'll take you out myself, and don't you forget it. And if you die, all your properties will become mine. I'm perfectly fine managing things that way. If you don't want to die, get out. If you don't get out, I'll kill you. Simple, right? Think about it, man. Don't screw with the five billionaires. Mr. President, are you all right? Uh. Yeah, I'm fine. The Leisure King will do anything to get what he wants. I'll probably have to fight him one of these days. I need to be careful. Ooh, look at that payout. So, uh, when does this take place? No, no, no. 70s? Hold on, wait! Money battle! 
Money battle. <laughs> we saved it. Uh, I believe this takes place either mid or late 1990s. Really? Yep. Hmm. Bring in the big bucks. Let's see. You invest. Yeah, that was pitiful. There we go. Double circle. And the health plaza. Oh, we don't have a double circle? All right. Yeah, she's still the best we have. I really need to get better security. I also need to look up who has the side story finder for Kiryu. Alright, uh, I'm still good for going for till 2.30, so, uh, let's see. I think we got enough that we can invest some more stuff into the real estate place. Also, probably should find a place to eat. Takoyaki. Soba noodles. Beef bowl. I'll go, I'll go for a beef bowl. Give me the beef. Oh, nope, I don't want to buy. Let me leave! Alright, what else to do? Go to the temple... There's a burger place over here? Well, you know we gotta go for a burger then. <sighs> Burgers! How do I get in there? There it is. Welcome to Mork Dornals. Uh, for hire? Get a shake. Stew burger set, tender. Alright, let's get this. Mm, mm. Wow, that table is so small compared to him. Uh, free smile. Never free smile. Here it comes. <laughs> oh, for here to go. I don't know why I said for hire. I think I'm starting to get a little too tired. People are probably going to be watching. I've already been like, wow, this guy's an idiot. No, nah, I'd be like, eh, you're not wrong. I am indeed an idiot. No. Yes. No. Yes. 
No. Yes. Oh, hey, cutie, you. <laughs> Let's increase the fun shui. Reduce the time it takes until revenue is ready for collection, and that's 20 CPE. Oh, our, our office is fully fun shui'd. Oh, is that what CP stands for? Charity points? Uh, no, I think that stands for, yeah, completion points. Uh. Yeah, it's just basically for doing stuff around town. It's it's like a little achievement system. Okay. But the game already has achievements. Money. It, it, it gets double the achievements. Alright, uh... What? Is that the... I double think. achievements? That's like... That's like... Two times the achievement. Least, that's like, at least three achievements. Wow. Wow. That means the ones you're getting on the Xbox are almost half. At least I'm getting them. And even when I fail, I still somehow manage to get them. Wow. Alright. Uh, yeah. I think this is See, the right one. They're not a friend, yep, there it is. I know she's a side story we can do stuff for. And I do need to get some, like, toughness. Looks like she's got something on her mind. Boy. Something wrong? You look a little out Tough. of it. Toughness in a bottle. Do I really? Well, yeah. I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have let that show. But you're right. Something's been on my mind all day. What's that? The head office gave me an assignment of sorts. An assignment, huh? Well, we have a lot of competition here from the M store chain and others. Our stores are very similar, don't you think? Come to think of it, I guess there's not much difference between your stores. That's why the head office asked employees from various branches to come up with ideas that would set Popo's stores apart from others. So that's why you were lost in thought, huh? Yes, I don't want to suggest something random that would only grab the customer's attention for five minutes. It has to work for the long term, too. Silly me, I should ask customers for their opinions. Do you have a few minutes to spare, Kiryu? Uh, I guess. Great, so, Kiryu, is there anything you'd like your, our stores to introduce? Let me think. What would I want to in a convenience store? Sofas by the magazine rack, a luxury brand good, or parcel delivery service. Hmm. Well, this place is cramped enough as is, so I don't think adding a sofa in here would be convenient. I think maybe a delivery service would be a better thing. That way, people would still frequent the store and buy stuff from it. Because I doubt that corporate would want to sp spend money on luxury brand goods. You have stores all across Japan. You could use that to offer a parcel delivery service. Oh gosh, that's a good idea. Why go to the post office or arrange a courier if you could mail or pick up parcels at the same store you were shopping in? It would be so convenient. I'm sure plenty of customers would make use of it. I just looked it up and you picked the correct answer. Whew. We also offer a range of discounts to further entice the customers. I think your idea is going to be a winner. You must be a business genius, Kiryu. <laughs> You're exaggerating. Well, he does work in real estate. True. I mean, I am the president of a company, apparently. I'll think it through tonight and see if I can draft a proposal. So, thank you so much for the ter terrific suggestion. I'm going to say she's probably going to become a uh, consultant. Hey, Tamo. Hey, TPG. Ah, damn it, they don't sell here. I was going to say, do you want some branded items? Because th this game does sell 7-Up uh, and Mountain Dew. Hmm. Nah, I got plenty right here. Okay. Yeah. 
Yep, we're, we're getting close. I even got a raise thanks to that. Yeah, that's great. But it was your idea to begin with, so I owe you a big thank you. I got you this. Hope you like it. A berserker charm. The head office people are so happy with this branch that they said we could expand our food offerings with a new hot snack that is only available here. Nice, isn't it? Yeah, congratulations. We're starting to sell this today. Can you guess what it is? Let me give you a hint. It's a, it's a delicious by itself or, or with soy sauce or mustard. It's specialty from Nagoya area. Goes well with soy sauce and, or mustard, you say? Uh, I'm gonna say mm. pork buns. Because you wouldn't add mustard to soup. Oh, no, wait, it's cutlets, isn't it? Because this place already does sell buns, so it has to be cutlets. It's miso cutlets. Yep, knew it. I think I got it. It's miso cutlets. Bingo! So, starting today, we'll be selling yummy miso cutlets. Yay! Can't wait to try one. I really like them, too. Oh, and the reward for guessing correctly is our brand new miso cutlet lunch set. Meh, yeah, thanks. You're welcome. Besides, it's thanks to your input that we have this on the menu now. I can't thank you enough. Yeah. You give me too much credit. Besides, look at you. You become a model employee, and you're excellent at customer service as well. As well. Hmm, you think so? Well, I guess I'm not as nervous around customers anymore. Not only that, but the head office likes your ideas too. Who knows? You could be the manager of the store soon. Oh, no way! I have so much more to learn before I can even start thinking like that. But if I'm getting better at my job, I have you to thank for that. How so? You were so scary looking that I was terrified of you at first, but we managed to become friends. Since then, I d don't get jittery around people anymore. To be fair, he has resting uber grump face. <laughs> R rusting grouch face. Rusting bitch face. Chatting with customers over the till became so easy. Come on, I'm not that scary, am I? Well, <laughs> anyway, I hope I can return to favor by making Popo your favorite store. Please, keep shopping with us. And with that, we are done with our side story. Yay! Which means we are never shopping there again. No, I'll still probably shop there if it's convenient for me. It is a convenient store after all. Oh, I like what you did with the place. Very feng shui. Let's see if we can invest a little bit of we can at the pachinko parlor. There we go. Perfect. And that's it. Alright, we'll do one more collection and then I think that'll do it for tonight. Right. So what Shiakasa is, uh, is that meme song, man? Uh, what? Which Yakuza game is that, uh, the meme song in? You uh, know, Dr. Mitai. Uh, that's this game. Oh, okay. It's it's in other games, but the one that has Kiryu singing it is this one. Okay. I kept, for some reason, I was just waiting for Majima to sing it. I mean, people have modded him so that he's the one singing it. Huh. Alright, well, we got a little bit of time to kill, so what can I do that won't waste too much time, but I can still... Oh, no. Dare I go to the JCC? Hmm. Uh, you know, I think I'm going to save that for when Moon and Dragon get back. Because I feel like they need to experience the madness that is that place. I guess I can do one more disco dance. 
Nope, it's not me. Go away. We'll do one dance and then we'll head back to the shop, uh, get our cash money, and then call it. <laughs> I'm just going to stick with this just so I can actually beat him. Alright, here we go. Ah, uh, one last dance I have. Yep. See if I can reclaim my title. Damn, dude. He needs to hit fever already. Would make sense. This is the final fight in the dance off stuff. What would you do if I managed it first try? Uh, be very impressed. I'm actually pretty good at rhythm games. He still almost doubles my score every time. Or beats me by 2,000. Well, you know how many points he's getting at the end. Yeah. I think it looks like he gets 5970 on easy every time, so you know when you have to beat. <sighs> it's either because I just keep getting the timing wrong with the presses, or I just get too greedy with my steps before I... Uh, do a move. In some cases, you're not greedy enough before doing a move. That's true. Alright. Well, I said I was only going to do one dance. So, we'll challenge him. Maybe I'll make that, like, the start of next stream of this game. That way, I have a lot more energy going into it. Because I think also, because it's super late, my motor skills are s starting to make a slow decline. Anyway. Or, it, that's the excuse I'm going to go with. I read pretty recently that, like, performance peaks at about three hours. Well, we're at four hours, so my performance is at a decline. Yeah. Huff, huff, huff. Shit. Oh, wow, they are on my ass. They gave up just as I ran out of breath. Hmm? Yep. Dip in. Yep, nope. Got a little bit more time for the payout. <sighs> I think that's another thing I don't like about Kiryu's, like, side story thing, is that you actually have to wait and kill time, whereas Majima is like, oh, you can... Uh, do it again with the girls, but at the same time, if you don't have enough, you get to swap them out. They're gonna get uh, less money because they're gonna get tired from working so much. Yeah. And I don't see any other places to invest in, so I guess for now. Oh wait. Hmm. hmm? This small child. He's been standing here for hours. 
kid all by himself. It's not safe here. I mean, even though there's literally a park right over here with playground equipment. Caught Spawn, why do you not play in the park? Hey, there's no place for a kid all alone. It's not safe. Go home to your mom. I don't want to. I don't like my mom when she's mad. What? Your mom got angry with you? Yep. I wanted to buy something from the super cool vending machine, but she flipped out. Super cool vending machine? Not like the ones here? It's nothing like that. It's a lot bigger, and it lit up with these bright lights. It's really, really cool. Why did your mom get angry over that? I don't know. My mom is always really nice, but she got really, really mad this time. She looks scary. Plan twist, it's because there's a pachinko machine. I, I think it might be the dream machine that he probably spent like over a million yen on it. Say, what are you doing here? My mom went out, so I took a train here. You came all the way here by yourself? That's pretty gutsy. I gotta hand it to you, kid. I did a lot of chores and saved up my allowance. Good for you. It's tough for a kid your age to save money. Yep, I worked real hard to get this far. But... What's wrong? I wanted to buy something from the cool vending machine, but it's all the way in the back of an alley. It's dark and kind of scary. Dark alley is dangerous for a kid by himself. Got it. And you're right. You're smart not going into a dark alley alone. A dark alley is dangerous for anyone by themselves. Yep, that's why I can't decide what to do. Well, I get what, what he's... I get what's holding the kid back, but does he really want to sit it that badly? Maybe I'll just get it for him myself. Okay, you win. I'll go buy this cool vending machine. I'll go buy from this cool vending machine of yours. You be good and wait here, deal? You do that for me? Yay! Didn't expect anyone to be so happy over this. So, where is this special vending machine? It's over this way. Follow me. Whoa, read it in, big guy. It's in here. But there's this weirdo in a bowler hat back there as well. Okay. There it is. Huh? Oh, no. Oh no! Oh no! Oi. Hey, your cool vending machine. I is it really the that one over there? Uh. Yep. It is something wrong, Mister. So you uh, the kid was looking at a vending machine selling a shilling adult magazines or adult merchandise. No wonder his mom flipped her lid. See, isn't it big and cool? There's no way he can give that junk to a kid. I hate to disappoint him, but I have to turn him down. Sorry, kid. I can't keep my promise. That vending machine is way out of your league. Go home to your mother. Huh? Why? Tell me why. You don't need to know just yet. But I already know something about the vending machine. There's a secret magazine in it. Those magazines are covered in shrink wrap. They must be super important to be protected like that. My friend's big brother said so. The shrink wrap's not for protection, not for the magazine anyway. You'll understand one day. But I want to understand now. They said it would be really educational. It's not something for you to learn now. Look, I'm an adult, but even I wouldn't know very much. It's deep. Did somebody say deep? Did somebody say deep? <laughs> there it is. It's not fair. You said you buy for me. Grown-ups always lie. Am I gonna grow up to be a liar too? I don't wanna! When I was a kid, I used to think adults were unfair too. Yet, here I am, just another lying grown-up. Alright, a man doesn't go back on his word. I'll keep my promise and go buy your magazine. Oh, you will? Of course, but you have to keep it a secret from your mom. No matter what. You're getting my magazine. Yay! Keep it down. Do 
you want to be treated like a man, you gotta be patient and quiet. Uh, yep. Sorry, mister. And thank you so much for helping me. You shouldn't expect too much. What a dilemma. I made the Kim a promise, but I can't really give that stuff to a child. What do I do? This kid is a picture of bright-eyed innocence. I can't give him the magazine, but I can fulfill my promise and buy it. Okay, I got this. It's too dangerous for you, so stay back. Let's do this! Someone's coming! And so am I! You could just hear Kiryu's mind just going like, Whoa. Ugh, I'm exhausted. Finally, a few minutes to myself. <laughs> this is reminding me so much of high school right now. Office workers on the break. Hmm? What do you suppose that man is doing there? Oh, you know what's at the end of that alley? Oh, right. He must be lonely at night. I'm surrounded. Better back off for now. But how can he bring a child with him? People are so shameless these days. Shh, he's coming this way. What's wrong, mister? Aren't you gonna buy it? Well, yeah, but... Oh, no! He's gonna go buy it! He he just he just walked right through those women. <laughs> those nosy women see me buying it. There's no telling what they'll say about it. I might have to wait them out. Oh, hi there, President Kiryu. Hmm. What? 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 What's Marina doing here? Why here? Why now? Mister? This is quite the predicament he's found himself in. Ne next thing you know, Mr. Shakedown just comes back down the alleyway, just like, Carry you! There you are! <laughs> and then Mr. Libido, too. Yeah, I see oh. you found yourself a very fine female specimen. <laughs> and you already have a child? <laughs> my my, you did quick work! But he walks past Kiryu Marina and goes to the two gossiping women. <laughs> what brings you out here? Oh, just wandering around. What are you doing here? I take my break at this park every now and then. I usually read or just relax on that bench. Why is the music so intense for just having a conversation with Marina? Because that's what, it, like, he's hearing boss music in his mind. <laughs> uh, okay. Sorry, we're in a hurry here. Oh, of course. See ya, then. I'll have to back off and hope for a chance. Wait. Does she have a son? Or does he have a son? Kiryu must reach the vending machine in the back without attracting attention. If he is spotted, Kiryu will become flustered and retreat to the starting point. Kiryu can choose Aww. to abandon the vending machine quest by speaking to the boy. Begin your dubious quest! Kiryu gets his own Metal Gear segment. Don't worry, Kiryu. I believe in you. <laughs> Just everybody's staking out this alleyway. Every everyone. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just going to train with Bacchus. I need to learn to punch people harder. D don't mind me. Yep. Ah, crap. Women. Lord. Have you seen a drunk man with a bowler hat back here? Oh! Mm. Better back off. Again, this hits very close to home for me. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna walk circles around my friend here. Damn it. I think I actually need to be slow for this. Or at least that last part. Yeah. Alright, wait for the turn. Marina, no, don't come this way! What? 
e where So I'm just going to start pacing back and forth like a normal person. Totally normal. Uh, women, my one weakness. All right. What is her pattern? That is a really weird pattern she has. <clears throat> Wait, that was the wrong person who spotted me. They're telepathic. Shit. Ah, oh, damn it. Watch me I'm not even doing this the right way, and there's actually a back way into it. Like, it looks like I can squeeze back there, jump the fence, and then get to the... Get to the magazine. Ooh, look at look at these pastries. Mmm, pastries. Oh, nice. President Kiryu, what are you doing here? Nope, nothing. Just taking a walk. Uh, sorry, but I'm in a hurry here. Of course. I'll see you then. Yeah. I just want to buy some smut in peace. Ah, damn it. He's so easily flustered. All right, when she turned. Yeah, she turned at the last second. Uh, Marina, you okay? Hey, at least um, at least she won't catch you this time. True, but still. All right, these two are a pain to get past. Yeah, seems like it. Alright, so when she walks there, maybe go over here into this corner. Go, 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 go! Got it! Aha, the mags are mine. I, I feel like Kiryu's wishing he had a really heavy trench coat and a, a very tall hat. And sunglasses. And and a giant fake beard. You were able to buy Some a crouch glasses. Yeah, you're able to buy a shrink wrap magazine. All that's left to, to do is get back to the innocent lad. Don't celebrate just yet, Kiryu. <laughs> oh, we, it automatically brings me back. Yay, Mister! You're so cool. This is far from cool. No way, you're my hero. Please, please, can I have it? Before I give you this, you have to promise something. Sure. This is important. You can't open this magazine until you get home. Even there, you can't let your mother see it. Ever. Huh? Where am I supposed to read it, then? You can't let anyone know about it. You can only read it when you're alone. Okay, I got it. And... There's more? This is the last thing. Don't hide it under your bed. It's not as safe as you think. I speak from experience. <laughs> yeah, that, that sigh he did just basically... Made me think, oh yeah, he, he, he did this as a kid as well. And he hid it under his bed. Yeah. It's okay. really not a secret, you think. Okay, I don't really get it, but this sounds like a pretty important... Good boy. Thank you, mister. I think as soon as he opens it, he'll understand everything. Uh, I don't know. I, th I think he's too innocent. I'll treasure it forever. It's really not that valuable. There will come a day when you don't need it anymore. Just be careful getting home, okay? Yep, thanks very much. And his mother walks right around the corner. Huh, grow up strong, kid. Ah, damn it, Marina. So nosy. It takes so much to be a man. 
And we didn't even get anything for that. Although we did get a lot of shame. I was about to say, the reward was the shame you brought along the way. <laughs> and I'm possibly going to be getting a lot of side-eye from Marina at this point. Alright, payout time. Ooh, 28 million. Yay. Alright. Let's do one more set of investments and then we'll call it. Gotta spend money to make money. Mm -hmm. And that pachinko parlor is the best in town. Yes. Hell Plaza is an A. Oops. Is that your best heart guy? Yeah. Or the more money you spend, the the more the investment goes into it. Yeah. From what I read, those uh, symbols affect how much the bar progresses when you invest. Oh, so it doesn't even matter how much you pay. No. Nah. Well. You could brute force it, I guess, but like, I think Masochist Demand would be best for that. Yeah. Look at how much pro bar you got just from that. I really do need to get more people in the food section because that was just pitiful. Yeah. Alright, that's good. That's still bad. She's still the best that we have for manager. And we almost got full uh, share from the Leisure King section. Which means he's probably going to come a-knocking pretty soon. I'll just do one check. Mm, it's taking a bit. I think we might be running into some trouble here. Nope. They call him kill you because they keep coming up to him and going, I'll kill you. <laughs> Why does everyone always want to hurt me? You just have a very punchable face. It's fine. Ow. Oh, wait, Eric. I got some medicine in there. Not you. Kill you. Alright, let's save. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where we are going to call it because we went even way further than I normally would. Ugh. I think mm, maybe one week, maybe I'll spend two days on Yakuza just because I, I want to finish this up before the halfway point of the year is up. Because I feel like we're getting close, and if I want to do one of the Kiwami games afterwards, I really do need to wrap this up soon. But I'm still enjoying this, and I, I feel like I don't want to waste my time here, but at the same time, I really want to do all the other side stories. So I think, like, maybe make it a two-night thing one week. Let's see who we can raid tonight. Who is still alive? And eh, we got a couple people. Let's see if he's still alive. Yeah, it looks like. Yep, he's still alive. Alright. Uh, schedule for tomorrow. Because I really couldn't do that today because I was too busy editing to get Sly out. Uh, gonna be doing some. Uh, yeah. Smash because I wanted to check out Pyro and Mithra. And then later that night, we will be doing more uh, 3D World of Dragon. Uh, then probably nothing until Wednesday because I do want to get the next slide edited and also get some more of the VODs up. So I don't think there is going to be any streams on Sunday, Monday, or Tuesday. 
But, of course, Wednesday will be the start of the Battalion Wars 2 Challenge stream, because I do want to see if I can continue that trend into that game. Thursday will be hopefully the end of Panzer Paladin, and we can move on to the second place winner afterwards and get some edutainment in our lives. Yeah. And then, of course, Friday will be this, and then I figure... Uh, if we can, I might only do two games this week because the other games I had on the list were pretty lengthy and we only have like two weeks afterwards. So I might dedicate a Thursday after we get done with Panzer and maybe Mario is uh, missing to Yakuza. But we'll see. For now, uh, we are going to go raid Mayo, who is playing some Pokemon Sword, or Shield, I think it's Shield. And it looks like he's doing Crown Tundra at this point. Which, I should probably get back into that game and check out the DLC. I've heard they're pretty good. Alright, that's gonna do it. Hope you all had fun. We're gonna raid him with hashtag, uh, resting Grinch face. Resting Grinch face. That 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 it just encapsulate encapsulates Kiryu's face. Yes, it does. I just think it's funny. <laughs> I mean, even his little dancing avatar has a re resting Grinch face. It's perfect. Yeah. All right. I'll see you all tomorrow for some Smash and some Mario. Hope you all had a good night. I will we'll see you then. Later. Potato. Mm, potatoes. Oh my god! <laughs>